Hey, welcome to the auction. Hello, hello. Happy Sunday. Happy Sunday, everybody. Hope you're doing well out there. Starting a little early. Just to say hi. Dennis do. Hi, Dennis. What's going on? Dennis, Ice. Your package will be sent tomorrow. Oh, send out a package tomorrow. Icing Crowns is here. Lurking. Hello, hi, lurkers. Icing crowns. Other lurkers. Crayons, crayons. Crayons. I say crayons. Crowns. Back by Silver's here. You're early. We're early, buddy. Oh, Jingle Meow. Hello, hello, hello. How you been? Hi, Jingle. Summers. Hey, Summers. Hello. Just talking to you about you today. Yeah. Good things. Good things. Nothing All bad. Good. No, no. Definitely not. Nothing bad. This is good. This is good. Okay. Okay. All right, cool. Good. Jimmy me off. Doing good. 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 That by Silver says hello. Hi, Larry Fisher. Huh? Larry Fisher in the house. Hey, back by Silver. How you doing? Hello, hello. The bar's open. Oh, cheers, everybody. Johnny's got his drink. Cheers, Johnny. Cheers. Might do a fireball shot later. All right, all right. So yeah. does everybody like Fireball? Johnny's getting after it. Does anyone like Fireball? <laughs> Just, we're, we're not auctioning Fireball. We're not auctioning it. Just asking if anyone <laughs> likes it. <laughs> Just in case when I tell everyone I'm doing shots of Fireball, then I'm doing it. <laughs> Dennis, do, Dennis do likes it. Yes. Jingle me out doesn't like it. Yuck. Yuck, she said. Yuck, Yuck oh. Summer's like loves Oh, fireball. okay. We got people like Fireball. Mm -hmm. I'm on a Fireball kick, and I'm on a buttery nipple kick, which is butterscotch schnapps and Baileys. <laughs> you tried ju juicing a ginger. Listen, you shouldn't do that to gingers. That's not yeah. nice. All right, all right. You guys are nuts. You guys are crazy. We'll stick with just beer tonight. Hope everyone's doing well. Hope everyone had a good day. It started off terrible weather here in Pennsylvania. Very rainy. But it's super nice. nice now, yeah. Mm -hmm. E and J Brandy. Okay, never heard of it. Whatever works, right? To each their own. One J. Ooh, do, do, do. It's cold here. Summer says it's cold. Cold? Dennis <laughs> said, said you need to tie one on tonight. Who said that? Dennis, do. Uh, Dennis, I tied one on Wednesday night. I can't time it on the night. I got a lot of shipping to do. Monday is my worst day for shipping after the auction and things I sell. He can't tie one on with what he's wearing. That's true. That's true. I got a special outfit on tonight. Seventy-two. Where's that nice. still at? He's in the Carolinas. Seventy-two. Carolina. I think it's warm day. I'm in shorts. Yeah, no, it was nice here. Yeah. I mean, after the rain went through, it got right. really nice. Yeah, it was terrible. Got a day off of cutting wood. Cut all over again. Chopping wood today? Yeah, chopping wood. Johnny's Last couple wood days. Chopper. It would make it fun. What? <laughs> Mike fired up. <laughs> Not bad. Then I would have to control fun, the computer. That's fun not, for you guys. That would, that would not be good for me taking over the computer. Johnny, I got a new power cord today. Wow. We don't have to worry about it coming off now and going. No. Look, there's Danger, no, there's, Will Robinson. We're no, out of battery. There's no tape over there. There's nothing. no tape? Oh. Official. I paid up for it. You don't even want to know how much a Microsoft Surface Pro 3, because it's an older, I have an older. I figure I Surface wouldn't even Pro. know what that is, so no. 
power cord is at Best Buy, for God's sake. Best Buy I had to go to. Best Buy. Hey, it's better than Walmart. Listen, yeah. I, if they had it at Walmart, I would have got it there because the pricing at Best Buy is ridiculous. Bruce Mai says, hey, hey, we'll try to stick around, but I have priorities. Bruce? Hey, I got, uh, Thanks for stopping mil- I got two military lots. <laughs> That's a priority. Hey, champions here. What's up, Ed? Hey, Ed. Hi, Bruce. Got some hockey cards tonight. Oh, yeah, that's right. And I told Ed I'd bring hockey cards. All right. Yeah. yeah I know what you're doing. Okay. All right. Yeah. Uh, do you have hockey cards? Yeah, but um, the upper deck ones, too, do you? Did I say it after? No, but the, oh, did I think we get through that be, box? There might be one or two in there. I yet. was thinking about that. Did we get through that box? There might be one or two left in there. Okay, because I saw you open that new box. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, the one we showed in the preview. Well, oh, I just put, we pulled some cards out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, that, yeah. but okay. I want to show that we're going to break a box. We're going to break a box open? Well, we're Yeah, breaking. that one, yeah. That one just doesn't yeah, yeah. We're breaking this box open. Yeah. Yeah. Brand new 1990. Yeah, okay. Yeah, we're gonna break that box. Yep. Uh, Summers didn't watch the preview, so just be she'll be surprised. She said, Woohoo! Surprise, surprise. I think there's one pack of that upper deck left. Oh, okay. And I did. Hey, 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 Castlevania. Gonna find about that. No, no, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I don't know. I would say, oh yeah, I'll send a note then. Okay. I'll send a note. Yeah, sounds good. Let me make a note for that. Make a note to send a note. Making a note to send a note. Oh, and I, I got some, I don't have them here tonight, but I got more horror horror uh, VHSs. Oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, okay, I got it. Okay. All right, listen, thanks for stopping by. We'll get started here in a minute. If you're brand new to the auction, welcome. If you're lurking, and you want to, how you doing? If you, Sorry to say hi. if you want to be part of the auction, um, there's a comment. The first comment I pinned up there has the link to the registration form. It's also in the description of this video. Click on the registration form, fill it out. It allows you to bid and allows us to get your items to you. Uh, make sure you're on live chat here in the chat, not top chat, live chat, so you can get the most up-to-date bids. Diamond West is here. What's up, Diamond West? What's up, Diamond West? We've been in $2 increments here. $2 increments, please, unless we tell you otherwise. When you win an item, you can pay with PayPal, Venmo, or Cash App. Venmo and Cash App information is scrolling across the bottom of your screen. PayPal, if you're paying... There's a link in the description of this video. Click on that link and enter the information there, the, the dollar amount. Uh, I had a little issues with PayPal, and but since we've been doing this link, it's been a lot better, so we're good to go. We have a thumbs down already. That means we're doing something right, apparently. <laughs> uh, when you win an item, we put your name into a drawing, and at the end of the night, we pick two names, and if you're still here in the chat when we pick your name, we'll add a mystery prize to your purchase. So stick around if you buy something till the very end to see if you win a mystery prize. And I hope everyone liked their eggs from Easter. Mm-hmm. I heard some good yeah, feedback good, on the eggs. We got so. good feedback on the eggs. Everyone, so everyone said it was a good idea. They thought that was cool. And the wheel is not rigged, just for those of you watching at home. <laughs> or the eggs weren't rigged. The eggs were definitely not rigged. Cash money in all the eggs. Every egg had cash money. How got a 10 on the egg? I watched it another day. I don't know what that means. Dennis Duke got a dollar. Oh, who got a 10 on the egg? Oh, I think Bruce, Bruce got a 10. Mice. Bruce got a 10. Bruce Bye's got a 10. I know that. We didn't hear back from everybody, so I think Bruce got a 10. And it was, there was two tens, right? There was two tens. So somebody else got one. I think Mike Bruce might have got both tens. Mm, maybe I'm Bruce not sure both. on that. I don't know. But we didn't hear anyone who got the fives. No, we? I don't think so. I think Craig Wolf got it. Craig Wolf twos. got a two and two ones. Okay. And Dennis, Dennis got, got a dollar. dollar. Okay. And I think Bruce got at least one ten. I don't know. I don't who think else. I heard from anybody else. I heard from icing crayons. And um, but they didn't get a ten. Bruce got Bruce two got tens. two tens. There you got is. both tens. Damn. Bruce picked wisely. 
apparently. You picked the right color. Oh. All right, speaking of uh, funny things, I have a funny outfit on tonight. Many of you who watched my uh, yard sale video or live stream the other day saw a preview of it. But, yes, I have a new onesie. This is the Grinch onesie. Let's see here. Look, it's an extra large. It's an extra large onesie. I don't know what to do with an extra large onesie. It's the Grinch. So much room in here. Look. Whoop. So we got the Grinch onesie on. I wonder how much a Grinch onesie goes for oh, on eBay. What do you think? You think I, I can sell this on? one? Oh, yeah. I got a hood, too. That's right. Hold on. I forgot. It's got the Grinch hood. And it's yeah. got like a feather thing on it. It's got head. a little winky on the top. Whisper. Wisher. <laughs> Alfalfa. What do you think? So there you go. There's my new Grinch outfit. If you like it, give me a thumbs up in the uh, in the video. Looks super cozy. It's super warm. And today it was like this morning was cool, but then it stopped raining and the sun came out. And man, it's warm now. So yeah, there's my Grinch onesie. All right, yeah, the Grinch onesie. Gosh. And no, I'm not wearing a onesie. I'm Johnny's sorry. up next for the next. I segment. need like a two X onesie. I'm a fat guy. <laughs> All right, Johnny's up first, as usual. Let's see what Johnny's got. He doesn't know what he wants to start with, so we're going to... It'll be a mystery to even me, because I don't have anything written down. I don't know what I want to start with. Jingle Meow says you're not fat. Oh, thank you. Bear Flag's here. Hey, Bear Flag. You got me on the... I caught him. I don't know. He's flat-footed over there. I'm flat-footed. Do I start with keys? Do I start with a house lock? Do I start with... Why don't you maybe do something that Bruce Myers might like because he said he might not stick around. I don't know. Then we'll start with the military. Okay. There you go. we got 14 people in the chat. All right. It's a small little military lot, but... Okay. Kind there of we cool. go. Ephemera lot so number one. It's five items. Ten box start. Okay. All right. Oops. We're going to start out with World War II aircraft identifications. Ooh. In this book. It's huge. Oh, wow. Show us, wait, stop and show some of those pictures. Yeah, I just want to show how oh, many, yeah, I mean, how it's many like, pages. It's yeah. like pages and stuff. Okay. I guess I'll just be able to tell what uh, what plane you got. Heavy Bomber UK, Glider UK. There's a Thunderbolt. U.S. Texan Grasshopper. This is from. Like, isn't it weird that they had that many different type of planes in World War II? It's a first printing. Ooh, Look at that. 1965. Yeah. It was the summer of '65. No. Yeah, I guess I should have looked this up. Probably. I just grabbed this today. You I did? brought it over today. But it tells you all that it basically is German. Italian, Japanese, um, USSR, UK, US, it's all about planes. All the military planes. It's a lot of pages, guys. It's 125 pages, and then you have this little chart in the back. Boom, chakalaka. Alphabetical table of contents. We got this. This isn't really military, but it's private planes. Let's see, let's see if I can find a year on this, guys. But it shows all kinds of other planes. No, oh, there's even some helicopters in there. Yeah, so, so it's kind of a cool. Then we have the Infantry Soldier's Handbook. It's signed by the guy. It does have a little hole in the first page. Just so you can see the hole. But it's signed by, I don't know, Sergeant Somebody. But it's 1917. Can you see that like that? Mm. You need to bring it, if you can bring it to the camera a little. Oh, uh, yep. All right, 1917. Yep. Okay, it's a sol the infantry soldier's handbook. Nice. That's pretty cool. World War One handbook signed by somebody. Yeah, I'm gonna. 
back. You do it, buddy. Then we have Dwight D. Eisenhower's favorite poetry. Prose and prayers. Prose and prayers. Say that ten times. Nineteen fifty-seven. Oh. Good housekeeping. So it's probably uh, Korean War, mm -hmm. but it's Eisenhower. And then we have Reader's Digest humor in uniform. I don't know what this is about, but nineteen sixty-nine. I'm sure it's got some kind of humor for military. It's got some staining on it. Mm -hmm. But there's the five pieces I have. I think the plain book is super cool. And this, yeah, that signed uh, this little handbook, handbook is signed by somebody. I'm going to go auction item on eBay. Yeah, maybe. Especially if you can find out who, who the, that is. Who that guy is, yeah. It so, was. It was a dollar back in 1917. Oh, that's probably pretty pricey. I mean, in a 1917, dollar? a dollar? That's probably like. A lot. But pitching a tent, mm -hmm. you know, it does. It's it is split here. I mean, I mean, it's, it's old guys. I mean, yeah, one hundred and four years old. But fire, rifle firing and infantry shoulders, you know, handbook and just pretty cool. Yeah, definitely some cool stuff there. I think that I like this plain one. It was kind of figure this was nineteen sixty five. It was two dollars ninety eight cents. It tells you everything about every uh, airplane, aircraft identification. And then we had a Horsa. A Horsa? High speed Horsa glider. Yeah. That was the UK, though. Mustang, I knew that. The Baltimore. Hudson, Ventura, hmm. Lightning, Avenger, Hellcat, Delcat. Yeah, all right, we got twenty dollars to Bruce Mize. Going once, looking for twenty-two, two, two, or more. We're gonna have to start somewhere. Yeah, why not? A lot of cool items, a lot yeah. of cool stuff. The private plane thing is pretty cool. I mean, I saw like you said a helicopter in here somewhere. Oh yeah, yeah, the private ones. Yeah, that can you like get a pro there. you can get like a private helicopter? These are military. All right, they have the military symbols on them. Maybe they uh, sell them. I don't know. Afterwards. After the war, maybe. Bruce says $1 in 1917 is equivalent to $20 today. I was going to say, I bet, because it was all about the engines. And... Well, cool little ephemeral. I don't even think I could find Oh, yeah. Thing. We lost. We didn't have our gloves on. Vintage memories. Uh, it's, it's not. Oh, <laughs> 1917. You're right. You're right. 1917. Right. That's my fault. We gotta put, get our gloves. I gotta get a pair of gloves out. That's right. We got them over there. Hold on. I'm getting a pair of Dang gloves out. I'm getting a new pair of gloves out. Hold on. I want a new glove. One that won't make me fit. That's I a forgot song. about the gloves. One that won't make me nervous. Tell me what to do. Vintage memories. Calling us out. We got the gloves. There you go. I forgot 1917. That's all the oldest thing here was like 1950s. <laughs> Sorry. All right, twenty dollars to Bruce. Final call. Called <laughs> out on it, man. Straight away. If there's no other interest, we're gonna sell it to Mr. Bruce Mines for twenty dollars. Hi, Christina. Po -po -po, Bruce so, Mines. Thank you, Bruce. Can I use, reuse the gloves since I already touched it once? Yeah. Okay. If only you're touching that same item. Okay. If not, when you change items, you got to change gloves. Oh, my God. All right. Um, Bruce, thank you very much. Let me put your name in the spinning wheel. Thanks, Bruce. Bruce. Mine. Right, start it out right away. Thank you, Bruce. All right, I'm gonna start with my uh, DVD lot because I know I don't I don't think my buddy Craig Wolf's making it tonight. Lot of ten DVDs. He might be lurking. Start a bit of ten dollars. I have a I have a very timely, relevant one. <laughs> this memory said so professional. All right, guys. 
10 DVDs, good condition, very clean. Look here, look what's first. Oh, didn't he just die he or something? Just passed away. Never, never waste an opportunity on stuff like this. Man. Oh, eBay got back to me. Did they? All time when I sent them a note. Any word on this? DMX, never die alone. There you go. Rest in peace, DMX. Uh, I never saw that one. I never saw this one. Hard Candy, Patrick Wilson. I guess it's some uh, horror. I don't know. It's like Fatal Attraction, it says. Well, Fatal Attraction was a good movie. Hard Candy. I never heard of it. Hard Candy. Bruce Mysey picked up 100 DVDs, all new Ooh, yesterday. All new, brand new? Yeah. Man. Stop out. You got wow. Christina at 10, looking for 12. The international stage sensation takes to the streets of New York. Okay, so are you guys familiar with this? It's like this group that uses like everyday objects to make like um, cool sounds and music and stuff. Like they bang on like trash can lids. Uh, and, like they got poles and okay. they make glass and stuff. Whatever. They they do all types of funky stuff. And I think it was like a show. Like you could go like a, like a Broadway show, but uh, not, not a play. You know what I mean? Like they would like put a show on for you. So this is a DVD of that. Stomp out loud. Yeah, I'm that. right on it. You're going right, that's right up your alley, Jeff. Al Pacino, I don't know. I know Al Pacino. I never heard this movie. Simone. A star is created. Simone. I think that's how you say it. Simone. And then we got Jackie Chan police story. Although that doesn't really look like Jackie Chan, does it? It does when it doesn't. It very it must be a very young Jackie Chan. Yeah. Oh, it's got one of these fancy cases. It's got the little tabby tabs. Tabby tabs. It doesn't. I mean, I don't know. Maybe it's me. Jackie Chan, Police Story, The Dragon Dynasty. Ooh. We got Jet Li's Fearless, the unrated version. Ooh. Oh, that's another fancy one. Tabs. There we go. Woo. Jet Li, Fearless, unrated. And we've got Jet Li, the one. Not a fancy. And I got Red Eye. A killer of a thriller, it says. The killer and the thriller oh, in Manila. Got, this has got a fancy case, too. Fancy, fancy. Red Eye. And then we've got a couple zombie ones, right? We've got Land of the Dead, widescreen, unrated director's cut. There's a lot going on here. Unrated director's cut, Land of the Dead, widescreen, Look at this zombie hand up there. All dead and stuff crawling yeah. up the fence without a body. Without a body. That's weird. It's 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 the guy from the um Adams family. What's the, the oh, thing. thing? Yeah, thing. Thing. Thing went thing went thing zombie. Was the, thing was the original zombie. Man. Yeah, thing went zombie. And then this uh Shaun of the Dead. It's a comedy with zombies. I don't know. I heard it's popular, though, Shaun of the Dead. I'm not really sure. Fancy case. Shaun of the Dead. There you go, 10 DVDs, good condition, very clean. You got DMX, Hard Candy, Stomp Out Loud, Al Pacino, Simone, Jack the Chan, <laughs> Blue Story, a couple Jet Lees, Red Eye, Land of the Dead, and Shaun of the Dead. Christine wants to know, are the zombies wearing onesies? I don't know. I don't think they are. <laughs> this one might be. This one's wearing something. Usually. I don't know. I don't know. So we got Christina at 10, looking for 12. I said going once just to get it moving here. Good deal. I said Sean is an awesome movie. Yeah, I've I heard like know. this is like one of those like cult classic things. Like is it, is it like like the one we always went to? What was the like Rocky Horror? Rocky picture? Horror. Yeah. It, it, it's something like it's with zombies and it's like I don't know. It's funny comedy. It's not a horror, it's, it's not a real horror, you know, like scary horror. It's it's Scary funny. Got more keys today, today, Dennis. Scary funny, not scary horror. All right, all right. All right, gonna do final call. Do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. Oh, Bruce, is Bruce is still here? I'll send the DVDs you won last night in my Crafters auction with the. What did you just buy from John? Oh, the books, military. Like he just bought that lot, right? Bruce? 
Yes. Yeah. Okay. Yes. We're going to send that all together. If you don't we'll send it all together for you, Bruce. I'm not going to separate them out, even though they're two. I just said, sent the name of the Waves hat to my colleague at the National War. To okay. I haven't talked to them yet. They haven't answered their, my calls. So I'm trying to get a hold of them to find more information for you, Bruce. They haven't answered any of my calls yet. So I don't know if they're not going to call me back. I, I reached out to them. So I will try to get more information. Yes, I have keys coming up. You want to sell it? Yeah. So, 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 ten dollars to Christina. Thank you, Christina. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um. Yeah. So, like, don't let me forget wherever you put Bruce's. Where, where are you having stuff? Oh, right here. Okay. You know what I mean? Yeah. I'll, I'll make. Sure. Yeah. I'm just saying. I'll, I'll, I'll put it here because I know it'll be separate but equal. All right. I might want to do this later. Oh, we didn't show I didn't show the pictures of your room. Oh, there you go, Christina. <laughs> Christina see it. We'll okay. do it here in a minute. Thanks, okay. uh thanks, Christina. Since I was that's what made me think about it. Thank you, Christina. Appreciate you. I'll put your name on the spinning wheel. So Bruce, I'll try to get a hold of her again to get her name. So they'll love it if it's going to a museum. That would be such a cool thing for them. You know, they know who it is and stuff, so yeah, I think they'll be happy. I think if I say something like that in the in the my next time I call them, they'll probably call back. I don't know. Okay, are we ready for me? Yeah, I'm ready for you. Whenever. I mean, oh, I'm I sorry. didn't know if you're sending. Oh, well, I'm gonna pull that up while you're doing it because oh, it's gonna take okay. a minute. All right, we're gonna do some keys. A lot of Since keys. Since we had someone ask about keys. All right. All right, separate them out a little bit. Flat keys, long keys. Starting flat bid. Keys. Well, keys on 15, 15, 15, 15, 20, 22, 24, 26, 20, 30 keys. We'll start at 15. Okay. I'll try to pull up these pictures here in a minute. We'll start doing. out with this one key here. We got another Ford model. I think it's a Model T key again. Ooh, fancy. I think this is see it. Let me see. Hold on. Oh. It's trying to focus on. Oh, there you go. And now come back towards me, right? And then, nope, over to the wall a little bit. But, yep, right there. Stop. stop, stop. There, there's a Ford key. There you go. Another Ford key. Dennis got you in there first, Bruce. Dennis at 15. All right. So here's three more barrel lock keys. Boom, boom, boom. I'm going to try to show you all the keys real quick. They're all barrel locked, those three. Okay, so show that. Here's some skinny keys. These are kind of cool. That's a real long skinny key. Oh, yeah. Eagle Lock Company on that one. That's pretty cool. So there's a bunch of flat skinny keys. Uh, these are just these are random keys, guys. I don't know what they. But this got some really cool scrolling on it. Can you see that light at all? Um. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yep. 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 Got some cool. He's got some cool scrolling on. Them. Thanks, Bruce. A couple more keys here. Oh, that's a VW key. Oh, cool. Yeah. The VW key. I'm just, I didn't notice it until still now. You see the VW? Uh huh. Uh huh. I sure do. Yep. Okay. And Clum. What the heck's Clum mean? Heidi Clum? I don't know. Oh, no. So there's some keys. There's some more barrel lock keys. Pretty cool. Mm hmm. That was fancy how you did that. Was that, was that fancy? Uh, that, <laughs> that was, was pretty fancy. good, wasn't it? Pretty good. You can see those. I don't know what kind of key this thing is. Oh, yeah. It was in the lot. I'm going to do it again. Oh, magic. Oh, oh, it's magic. magic. You know. Got to believe. And three more. Awesome. Um, 
barrel lock keys. There you go. Very 30 cool. keys all together. Bunch of barrel lock keys there. Two, four, six, eight, ten of the barrel lock keys. Skinny keys. The flat. I call them skinny keys. They're flat. Too many of those. The cool Ford and BW keys. Pretty cool. I probably should look that BW key up. Mm -hmm. I know BW keys sell. Yeah, Ford's key sell. Like that old Ford Yeah, the, the, I think it's a Model T key. Yeah. That's house. So, 30 um, keys. We got Dennis Dew at 15, looking for 17. I probably still have or probably more. 10 pounds of keys. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. That's a lot of keys. Go in once. The Dennis Dew, $15. Trying to get a little little action going here. Think about what I'm going to sell next. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, Dennis came in first at 15. Mm -hmm. Looking for 17, guys. Mm -hmm. Keys. These barrel lock keys, I usually sell them three, four bucks a piece at the antique shows. So I don't know if I'll sell them any more of these if I don't get some more money on these because I can make money of those in the antique. And I have an antique show in Virginia, close to Dennis Do. Oh boy. Fishersville, Virginia, Dennis Do. I'll be there May 7th and 8th. Johnny will be signing autographs. Two dollars an autograph. Antique show, you know where Fishersville, Virginia, right there, Stanton, Staunton. Staunton, yeah. It's right there. Like Braves because of my grandmother. Okay. Oh, wow. Hey, you got that Braves jersey from me. That was a nice Braves jersey. Oh, yeah. That was a nice one. The stitch one. All right, Bruce is out. So I'm going to say final call. Any other interest on 30 vintage keys? We got some barrel keys. We got a Ford Model T, maybe, key. We got a VW key. A Ford, cool. A Ford key for sure. We're not sure. We're not really sure if it's a Model T. We think maybe. I think it's a Model T key, but I don't know for sure. Jingle Mail says she'll take an autograph for two dollars. See, you set up yourself a little booth I set there. A little booth up Get sign. like headshot photos. I like, do a little kissing booth too right. or something. I mean, Donna won't like that, but extra buck. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> kissing. No, autographs two dollars, kisses five dollars. Oh, you're just multi, yeah. multi, you know, multi purpose. That's a seven dollar profit. Right. Kissing, right. kissing an autograph. Hey, Lauren's here. Hey, hey, Lauren. Hey, Lauren. <laughs> All right. Any other interest? Fifteen to Dennis. We're gonna sell it unless we get a little bit more. We're looking for seventeen or more. Right. So Dennis then. is still looking for that liquor cabinet key. Yeah. <laughs> Back like Silver said, you're gonna pay me five dollars to kiss you. <laughs> sold, sold, sold. That is due. Thank you, that is due. Thank you very much, Dennis. Do thank you, Dennis. Fifteen dollars. That will be coming in a separate package. I already packed yeah. the other package. Thank you, thank you. Yes, Sandy Kirk is here. Hi, Sandy Kirk. Hi, Sandy. And uh, Sandy said, I heard you have the onesie on from. The yard sale, the garage yeah. sale. I do, Sandy. Here it is. It's the Grinch. I had to roll the sleeves up a little bit. It's very large. It's a very large onesie for those of you that are used to my medium-sized onesies. This is a. This is very large. What are your notch locks? Uh, for, uh, probably. I can't see. I probably the house lot. Okay. But I want to show. All right, so. Yes, I do have the onesie on from the weekend, right? Um, so we asked for pictures of Johnny's house. These oh. are random photos of, of Johnny's rooms in my house. Random rooms. So it's not every room. No. It's but only... it, take these pictures and then extrapolate it out. Yes. you got to figure out a 3,000 square, square, right. square foot house. A mansion, basically, is what he has. Oh, Old, like, 1847. No, it's like, new. Victorian. It's 2000. It's got secret staircases. Oh, my God. And a butler's pantry, I'm sure. Yeah. And yeah. a wine cellar, definitely. And okay. a newspaper. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you're welcome, Lauren. I'm glad she. Uh, I'm glad she liked it. That was good. All right, so here we go. Let's share the screen here. Let's see if I can do this. This is Johnny's random pictures from Johnny's random this is, house. This is a couple of rooms. Pic I may have a couple, maybe two pictures from rooms. John's house. It says. All right, let's see if we can make sure we see it. That's one pile in a corner of one of the rooms. 
Take it in. This is for Christina. This she... is definitely for Christina. That's one one pile there. Here's another pile. That's right, ac right across from that pile. <laughs> is this a tower back here with DVDs in it? Yes, it is. Okay. No, that's a tower with I mean, VHS, with VHS, yes. VHS Yeah. What's this, wine rack thing? That is a um, golf club rack. Pool? No, yeah. pool stick rack. No, that's a, for golf clubs. Oh, it is? Yes. It doesn't look like... It, you hang it up and it, you shoot the, the, the golf ball sit here. Oh, in the bottom. Oh, okay, yeah. Okay, cool. Twenty bucks for the one pop. Now this is one room. Just I opened the door and took a picture. He, he can't even. This is as far into the room as he can get. And no. You see where the plastic tub is? The plastic this, tub. This. Yeah. Those boxes. Now that there's a bed in there. <laughs> Somewhere in there is a bed. Now this. Like, where in the world is Johnny's bed? That them boxes there are there. Going on 10 years. They're These boxes there. right here? Yeah. 10 years sitting right there? Yep. I don't know what's in any of them. Bruce Myers says, John, you got a problem. We need to talk. <laughs> Can we bid on the piles? Uh, Give me 20 bucks for the one pile. Batman, lurking Batman, says it's a hoarder's paradise. It, it, and it's pretty clean. It's clean. It's not junk. All right. I think we have one yeah, more. One more picture. We got one more. Whoa, this one. This and that is, I can tell you if you see all the steward. Yeah, there, that's this is, NFS. This is, this, is, this is my closet. Man. Right. This is, half of this is NFS. You're not selling any of that. None of that stuff's stuff right. for sale there. No, but this whole pile is in my closet. Right. Now, I have a pretty big closet. Yeah. Again, mansion, Victorian era. It's beautiful. There's towers. There's minarets. It's great. Yeah. There, that's, a, that's a cradle. <laughs> a cradle. Right. It's on its oak, side. It's an right? oak cradle on yeah. its side. They got a clock. Go. Is that what that is? That's a gingerbread clock. Oh, there's one of those uh, jack o' lanterns. Yeah. Yeah. Chairs. Cool yeah. And some clothes here. Yeah. Yeah. And there's some cards in there. Yeah. Like there's cards, cards there. there. Yeah. yeah. Some books on the floor back there. Yeah. They're, the, they're all uh, World's Fair stuff. This is the secret. That's uh, a secret, secret stash area. Secret staircase yeah. I was telling you about. All right. So that's um, Johnny's. Just see. Johnny's. Uh, Pictures from Johnny's house. Now I promised Christine I get it. I got it. We there should it is. we should make a segment like um like they do on like the um like some of the well, shows, every like, week picture like, of one of my do, 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 do. pictures from John's house. I could have like a thing come up. <laughs> you could do a like, YouTube channel. Do, 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 do. I pictures get from John's that, house. Though. Yeah, you could. Yeah, John, you could do it. You don't need to talk or do anything. Just all your video is is pictures from John's house. And every week you upload like one or two pictures and just let it just do it out there. Put some free music on the background there. And just do, 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 John's. So there's John's pictures, house. you guys. I promise you pictures how long ago, but there you go. It's true. All right. So Dennis do. Let's get back to this. If you for see a anything in those pictures you want to buy? That's right. Dennis. Oops, I spelled I spelled Dennis wrong. Do I only put one in? All right, Dennis Do is in. You might have to do a shot after that, just because you saw my house. All the pot as the piles sell a new soap opera. I like that too. In one of those tubs, I would assume. So where's Jimmy Hoffa in one of those tubs? He said, "My house looks more full." Oh, that's that's just that's uh, just three rooms. Dude. That's not even three rooms. <laughs> like nothing. That's a closet in one room and part of another room. Okay, back to the auction house lot. I'll hey jingle me out. If it's from the sixties, I'll come there and look at it. <laughs> Starting bid. Fourteen. We got a little weight on this one. A little weight. I got some cool stuff in here. Okay. Fourteen. All right. House lot. I didn't write it down, John. If you can help. Is that an open? No. Oh, man. Come on now. I have unopened eight tracks. Bring them. I should try to sell them. Uh, here's the house lot all together here. All together now. A lot of cool stuff in here. Let's check it out. About an eight track. This is what Johnny was looking at. I, don't, I never took it out of this. This is Glenn Miller, pure gold, baby. Glenn Miller, pure gold. Looks like I don't been, care for his ghost up there. Oh uh, well, look, I never. I'll looked. become friends. I think it's busted. Let me see. Yepper. Yepper busted. All right. Well, you know what? Goes along. Goes along. And I'll, I'll add something else to it. We'll add a, we'll add a super prize. Jingle. I'll be fine. K9 Security Patrol. Dog. I'll become friends with the ghost up there. Yeah. K9 Patrol. Security Patrol. Camp Teddy Sung? Teddy Use? 
Thirty years old. I, I don't know. know. 1967 Girl Scouts patch. Wow, that's cool. Pretty cool. Um, wait, look at this. I got this kaleidoscope. I don't know. It, I think it must have something. I mean, this like looks like Funkadelic. It's got 69 cents on it. I didn't look it up. It says <laughs> Stevens Manufacturing, Herman, Missouri. Number one fifty. Christine says she, I can borrow her. I can loan John my spirit tester to go into. Right. Yeah, let me see. It. Does it work? Hmm? Does it work? Oh, yeah, yeah. oh kaleidoscope works. I got one of these things. Remember one of these? Like, if I was a kid, this this I would know. last like two seconds, right, two and I'll be done. This is one of those things you would put the bills on or your receipts, like when you go to a restaurant, oh, yeah. you see the checks, and they put the thing in. Got that. Um, I don't know what this is, but I hated to just get rid of it. Um, it's some kind of like pouch. I don't know. It's not really a pouch because the sides are open. But it feels like like real deal, some kind of animal skin. I feel that, Johnny. It's got to be something real. Right? It's leather. Yeah, it's leather for sure. I don't know. It's definitely leather. I don't yeah. know. I got a uh, cars puzzle. And it was taped shut like this when I got it. So I really don't know what's in there. Either. That could be Thatcher tape. Oh, like, yeah, the, I mean, that might be just the way they came. Maybe, this, you know, maybe it was unopened. I don't know. Car shape. I'm trying to see if there's a year. 20. No. I don't see a year. I um, saw a year. Vintage Member says that could be used to hold old maps. What? That little leather thing. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, maybe. I don't know what it is. I'm not in. Right? I didn't want to just get rid of it. Yeah. So it away. My Kretzer in the house. Oh, hi, Kretzer. Good to see you again, buddy. What's up, buddy? Um, I got this pack of new ace mounting corners for uh, holding photo prints, greeting, and postcards in album and on mounting cards. Price was 10 cents back in the day. Looks like it was never opened, never used. I don't know. 10 cents. The, 10 book, cents. the book cost more than that. Right. So there's that. Uh, I got another one of these, um, what are these, like tissues or something? Rolling papers. Oh, yeah, right. Oh, uh, them things you put around your neck for like the uh, barber? No, I think that they're um, I think they're like because I had this with another one. Oh, okay. Like pocket tissue company. Oh, uh, okay. Like you could work, but it's got some advertising to work for some cosmetic deal or to be to sell something. I don't know what it was. I sold one before in a, in a lot. Well, I got some. Uh, I don't know. Look at this funky pen. It's got numbers on it. It's got a twisty top here. What's it say on it? Col no roller roller rule. Roller roll. roll. And I don't know. Maybe you can take measurements. I'll just see. Yeah, there we go. Like, but yeah, it looks like it has a red ink. I don't know how you get, get it out. Oh, this thing, when you turn this, it moves. I don't know what you do with this thing. Tinko says no one's been in her grandmother's attic since 1998. Wow. I want to go. Really? I want to I want to get in that. There's another little pen. I didn't look up this. I know there's no markings on it that I could see. It's got a little dangly J hanging off of it. So, John, maybe this is your pen I stole from you. Yeah, yeah. Damn, pen thief. I don't know how, I don't know how you would make it. Christina says they're blotting tissues for oil in your face. Yeah, there you go, blotting tissue. Oh, so there's your pen. mom's jingles. Okay, your mom's house. No one's been in there for like 20 years. It's awesome. Here's There's some good these, stuff up there. Remember when you were in school and you had those pens that had like the different colors? And you could, oh yeah. This is like an older, older version of it. Yeah, but it's not. It's got a. It's got a wear. Oh no, those rooms never get cleaned. Robert Murray says on it. Robert Murray. I do go get through those boxes in the one room. It's been there for like ten years. I don't have no idea what's in those boxes. It doesn't really work too well. There you go. You can make it green. Always room for more stuff. Blue. That was the idea. That was the idea of the warehouse is to clean my house out and put it in the warehouse. Mm -hmm. Just the warehouse filled up so fast. I'm thinking about doing that myself. <laughs> Not with a warehouse. Uh, Valley Forge Council Camp Delmont. I don't know what this is. Some kind it's, of it's got to be. It's got to be Boy Scout or Girl Scouts. Yeah. But what? It's like a bag. I don't know, not a bag. It's like a metal thing. I don't know. I got some, what do you think these are? Like business cards? It's got somebody's name. I didn't open it. Some Kurt Shaw. That's right, Bruce. I don't have to vacuum those floors. It's so full. I don't know what these are. 
but they got like a little gold toned edge to them. Kurt Schlox. Oh, Philadelphia PA somewhere. Mm -hmm. Cortland Street. West Cortland Street. Maybe Philly Kitchen that was. Oh, John, I bet you don't know what this is. What do you think is in here? Sewing kit. Sewing kit. Look at that. Woohoo! Pulled it out. I thought it was matches at first. But look, it's got this old phone number on it. RA2. I don't know how you did that. 3000. Okay, we got Bruce at 14, looking for 16 guys on this uh, oh, house lot. Yeah. Bruce, says he, Bruce says he has a rare January house business card for sale. Yes, he's probably got eight million of them. There's two of those. Um, I got a number of these 45 adapters. I got metal and plastic. The rare one that has, if you have the January Oxen House business card, then yeah. you got something. There's none out there. There's none out there. This is... Uh, Western, or no, I'm sorry, Webster Chicago Corporation. There's 10 of these. 10 of these. And then these are plastic. I don't, I don't know if they have markings on there or not. I think there's six of these. Yeah, there's a red one. Um, Re record time? Rico time? I don't know. So these are for 45. Right, to change it. To, it's to go to your record player. Yeah. If you don't have the little, the little, little plastic, piece, the little plastic right. square. Oh, piece. look, I got a key in here. That is not a key. What is it? Oh, it is a key. Okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> Why would you think it's? I thought it looked like a lamp, like you know, your turning thing for a lamp. What? It is a key. What I said, I didn't see the bottom. A turning thing. Like you, you put like it in like it, this it, Yeah, you put it in a lamp and you screw it on yeah. and it turns on. It and I got I don't know what this is. Sonny Roberts Orchestra. Yeah, the, the A track Mike Kretzer is is Compy Wampus. It's Compy Wampus. It is what is it, Glenn Miller? Glenn Miller, but Glenn it's, Miller, it's broken. But the tape must have tore inside somewhere, yeah. so you have to Open it and fix the tape and all I'll that. add something else. I'll grab something else here in a minute and add if we have interest here. Uh, Sunny Roberts Orchestra. I don't know. It's like some kind of advertising, like uh, megaphone thing. Oh, looks like a cigar cigarette holder. Oh, maybe that you is. You put a good. cigarette in there. Yeah, that's what that is. It's oh, a cigarette I holder. That. I thought orchestra, megaphone, like music. Yeah, but I think it's a yeah, cigarette. Right. I think it's a cigarette holder. Well, you know what? There's some kind of brand name inside. I'll never be able to read it. I don't know if you can see what's in there. Oh, look at this pouch. I got this leather pouch with, I don't know what this is. Wow. This is a compass. I don't know what this is. There's no markings on this thing. There's a name inside it, but I can't see it. But I, yeah, yeah I think that's a, a cigarette, cigarette hold, um, cool. a lady cigarette holder. Yeah, that's pretty cool. And I got this compass thing. I don't know what this is. And it's got no markings on it, but it comes in this little leather pouch. Is it a compass? Well, that's, that's not a compass. You know what that is? Mm -hmm. It's a weed scale. A weed scale? Yeah. What is a weed scale? It's how you weigh your weed. What? How do you weigh it on the other <laughs> side? <laughs> Let me show you. Where do you put weight on it? You got to find weights and put them on. See, you, you hang it on right. this, and it pulls the weight. Usually there's a roach clip on the end of this. Yeah, but how do you... How do you balance it with the weight on the other side? No, this is this is you hang it, you pull this, you put your weight on it, it tells you how much it is. Yeah, okay, but what I'm saying is, what, what, what if you what if it doesn't pull that much down? Well, then you don't have enough weight on well, it. Well, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. So is that? But usually, kind of scale, if you put a baggie on it and it's got a little grams. Up, yes, that's more. You need more than that to pull down. No. What is it in ounces? It's kind of two ounces. Yeah, you, you got one ounce, half ounce. I mean, you're not weighing grams. You're weighing a okay. quarter to You're eight. weighing some seriously. You know what it actually is? It, it's a postal. I mean, it, it could you could weigh anything with it. Did you ever see the postal ones? That, that no, I'm I'm aging myself no, here. I have a thing with digital numbers. Yeah. <laughs> John demonstrates with an item that right. vast, vast experience. Vast experience. Yes, I've I've, 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 I've used these. Oh, weed scale, cool. I wonder if you can list it like that on eBay. Weed scale. <laughs> I, oh, I, I I partaked in that a few times in my time. Check out this one. I probably should look this up. I saw it afterwards. 
Schrader Universal Tire Pressure Gauge. See, Vintage Memories after she sees, hears about the weeds game, go 16. Right, she goes 16. <laughs> Schrader Universal Tire Pressure Gauge. Oh, no. Brooklyn, New York. Look at this little tire pressure gauge. Oh, that's cool. And I, I think at one time you could see what the numbers were in here. Oh, it looks like it's all like, it's all used up now or whatever. Like, I don't know. It's cloudy. Cloudy with a chance of meatballs. Well, that's cool. So we got a bunch of stuff here. We got a bu we we got a weed scale. We got a tire pressure gauge. I'm gonna say it's a postage scale. Postage probably, scale. But, we got. But oh, it, I gotta grab something. But you had to pull this. You hang it up here. Okay. And you put your little baggie on here. It tells you how much it, how much it is. Yeah. Gotcha. Okay. You can weigh anything with that. Anything that takes at least an ounce. Up to two ounces. Right. Well, I mean, it's got to be. What There's zero ounces. Half ounce. Ounce. Yeah, see? yeah. So if you got a dime bag, you're kind of like right there. <laughs> Get the hell out of here. It's all seeds in that dime bag. Uh, let me find. What else can I have? Uh, uh, look at Mike. All seeds. He knows stuff about. He <laughs> he comes out of nowhere. It's all seeds. I'm not getting anything good. It's all seeds. It weighs that much, and it's only a dime bag. It's seeds. <laughs> Not weed. Oh, oh my gosh. Sorry guys. We we went off on a little tangent there. All right, we got Bruce at 18 looking for <laughs> I don't know. I'm trying to find something else to put in here. I gotta be with you know quarters of gram. Right. <laughs> how, many, how many grams in a Oh else? my gosh. All right. How about I change it up for this for this for this Asian Okay, so we got Asian vintage coin. memories at twenty. Asian coin with a you throwing that in because of the I'm A track? This in because of the A track. We're throwing that funky coin in because of the A track. I don't know what it is. You can look it up. If anyone likes A tracks, I got country unopened A tracks. I think I got seven of them. Country unopened A tracks. All right. Since Bruce is out, final call on it. Vintage memories at twenty. Uh, vintage memories and Bruce were the ones. Oh, I thought you said Christina earlier. Oh. All right, what do, do you want the A track? If you don't want the A track, just let me know because I won't ship it with it. It's broke. It's broke. Let me just show it again. It's not broke. It's just the tape tore off inside. You can fix it. You can. Yeah, because you got to open it up. It's a pain in the butt. But I oh. years and years ago, my brothers used to fix them. Okay. You can fix them, but it's 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 a pain. You got to splice them and yeah, trying to show like you can't you see. right. You can't see if you go there. You can't see the tape. It's probably right. inside. Yeah, you can just pop. You can actually pop the eight tracks open and just you can tape them right. and stuff. We'll throw it in there. If they want to throw it in. Someone else might want to try to fix it. Okay. Oh, there's a receipt. Man. You can find out how much they paid for. Back in the it's day. not broke. It's just oh, if any of everyone, she doesn't want the eight track. Okay. And she's the leader. Yes, yeah, she's the leader. Well then, we can. And then, if there's no one else, then we can sell. What was it at twenty? We're at twenty. You want to sell? Mm -hmm. Sold, sold, sold. Twenty dollars, fifty oh, memories. Oh, I'm sorry, Bruce came in. Sorry, that came in before. So we're looking for twenty four. I thought someone. Maybe you said Bruce. Bruce and Vintage Memories were in, but yeah, I thought you said Christina. It must have been Bruce. Okay, I'm sorry. Um, Bruce came in before I hit sold vintage, so we're at 22 looking for 24. I apologize on that, but Bruce came in before it came up. That was close. Nope, it's not sold. I'm sorry, vintage memories. It just Bruce came in before the sold came up. Okay, vintage memories is out to Bruce. I apologize about that, but he came in before... We have a lag. All right, does Bruce want the eight track? Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna sell it now because Vinny's is out. And we're sure Christine's out, right? Yeah, I think Christine uh, Vinny's memories. Are you out for sure? Um, I apologize because you saw it came up before I hit sold. Yeah. yeah. I'm gonna Good sell it on. to Bruce. I don't think Bruce. Uh, once the A-track Okay, cool. Cool, cool. Thank you, guys. Oh, that's a big lag. Right. Okay, we sold $22 to Bruce. Thank you. 
Thank you, Bruce. Thank you, Bruce. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Bruce. Already, Bruce's pile is up here. Okay. All right, we're gonna do these cards first. All righty. Thank you, Bruce. Appreciate you, Bruce. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Congratulations. Hey, I sold some DVDs. Bruce. Whoops. Bruce. Mines. I forgot to hit enter before that. Thank you, Bruce. Appreciate you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right. So, Johnny has a lot of unopened. We'll find out how many. We're starting at 12. 12. And we're going to start it at 12. And every two dollar increment will add a pack of their choice. I just have hockey, baseball, and football. And I only have one of the hockey upper deck left, and the rest are 1990 tops. Thanks, Bruce. So I'm breaking we're breaking a box open. So I just pulled three packs out of a brand new box. Hey Cat D. So we have a whole new box to put out if you want hockey cards in 1990 tops so we have four packs of hockey four packs of baseball four packs of football so we got three packs of 1990 tops hockey mm. i have one pack this is the last pack so i'm throwing it in this is the upper deck 93 94 right that's what i was thinking of that's earlier. the only one yeah. i have left okay so we have two packs each of 1990 tops baseball and 88 tops baseball we have two packs each of 95 Tops Series 1 football and Collector Choice 1995 football upper deck. So that's what we have. We have 12 packs, and then we'll add a pack every $2 of whatever you want. All right, we're at 12 to Cat D. Looking for 14, 14, 14. 14, 14, 14. So we got what cat in 12, huh? Okay. Yep, 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 yep. 14. And what would you like to add in? Ed, I think you want hockey. If I'm right. I'm pretty sure he's asked for hockey, so I'm going to say hockey is going to be the add in. The lag is incredible to Yeah, we have bad lag, guys. So I'll be careful on hockey, please. All right, that's what I thought. There's right. another pack of hockey. We got 13 packs. And we're at 14 looking for yep. $16. And we'll add another pack at 16 right? Yep. yep. Every two dollar increment, we'll add a pack. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And like I said, I, if, I don't know if anyone saw that I'm breaking a brand new, well, that's no, not brand new, NOS, new old stock hockey box. These are the first packs out of the hockey box. Nice. All right, Cat's at 16. Cat, what kind of I'm cards assuming do you she's going to want hockey also. We got hockey, baseball, and football. Football. Basically, what's on the on the screen right. here is what I have. We're just gonna add to it, right? But I'm assuming she's gonna want hockey. Yes, hit the thumbs up button for me. Thank Fresh you. Fresh box being opened. Hockey. Got hockey. it. Got it. All right, we got fourteen packs yep. of cards. Looking for. Eighteen dollars, and in two weeks I'll bring hockey cards in a box, just random ears. It's in a box. So if anyone, I don't think we're having a sale next week. Right. Yeah. So just so you guys know, we're going to talk about it at the end. No Sunday night sale next weekend. Taking a break next week. But the following week I will bring hockey cards. Already, you know, just a box of random hockey cards. Right. Right. On, uh, Open hockey. Yeah, open. they're already open, but card. Yeah, it's single it's individual. It's individual cards. cards. It's going to be a like a pretty close to an eight hundred count box. Yeah, one of those count. 
Ed's at 18. I'm sure Ed wants hockey. Hockey, hockey, probably. All right, Bruce. Thanks, buddy. See you, Bruce. Thanks. I'm just going to assume that Ed wants hockey. Yep. I would think. Hockey, baseball, or football. I'm just going to throw the hockey pack in there because I'm hockey, pretty right? sure it's hockey. Yeah. All right. 15 packs of cards, and we are at 18 looking for $20. Look for 20 We hit 20 We add another pack. Wanting to cat D. Well, I'm gonna assume she's wants hockey. Well, it might be it might be a whole hockey night. Yep. I'm adding a hockey pack because she had, she did hockey last time. Let's see, cat. Are you confirming a hockey pack? Mike Kretzer's trying to bid two dollars. <laughs> Mike Kretzer's bidding twenty two. All right, Mike Kretzer. Cat wants hockey, which we added, yep. all right? And then Mike Kretzer, you get to pick. You want hockey, baseball, or football? And now, and then we'll be at 17 packs at $22, yep. looking for $24. As soon as Mike tells us which sport he wants. Basketball. We no, don't have basketball. Baseball. Baseball. BB, BB is baseball. Baseball, Sorry. okay. Nah, I have a different pack. I want to throw a 91... 91 tops pack in there. 91 tops. Yeah, there we go. All right. And then we got Cat D at 24 looking for her pick. is probably hockey. Right? I'm going to assume it's hockey. I'm just going to throw it in there because I'm positive it's going to be hockey. Heads out. So we're at 18 packs of cards. $24. Oh, my cruncher jumped it up a little bit. Hold on a second. Let's confirm Cat wants the hockey. And then you're going to need another three packs. Six, eight, thirty. Yeah, tell me what three packs you want, Mike. All baseball. All baseball. Does he have a preference? I have. I'm going to add a 91 Fleer. But I have all those different kind of baseball. Well, I'll just do this. Just grab it. Yeah. It was a good thing. I'll put another 19 there. Okay. So we're caught up. Yep, we're caught up. Cat D is at 32. Cat D, you want another hockey, I'm assuming, right? I'm going to still hockey so in. So we got 22 packs at $32. Yep. And we're looking for 34 or more. 34 to Mike Kretzer. I'm assuming and baseball again. Baseball again. We've got baseball and hockey fans here. I'm gonna just gonna throw that in because that's I'll try to keep up with mm -hmm. each, each amount of packs. Right, three of each or two of each yeah. or whatever. So yeah. I got three of those, two of those, one mm -hmm. of those. Baseball, yeah. All right, so we've got twenty-three packs at thirty-four dollars, looking for thirty-six dollars. Well, Cat D jumped it up to 40, so you're going to need three more packs of hockey. I'm, I'm assuming, assuming it's going to be huh? three more packs of hockey. Boom, boom, boom. There we go. Okay, $40. Cat D, we are at uh, 25. 10, 15, 20, 25, 26 packs. 26. 26 packs at $40. Looking for 42, two, $2. Forty-four, so you're gonna need two more packs to Mike Kretzer. I'm assuming baseball. Okay. Yep, baseball. Yep. So we're at twenty-eight packs, forty-four dollars, looking for forty-six or more. Okay, added two more packs, right? <laughs> Kretzer said, "I'm done." Added two more packs. You don't know. You wait till Cat D adds. Another two bucks, and you're going to add two bucks. All right, so there we go. 
28 packs. Cat D says 50, so you need three more packs of hockey. Three more packs of hockey. I got it right here. Boom. <laughs> three more packs of hockey going so, in. 31, right? So we have 31. Yes, 31 packs. Yep. Unopened. Bring them a little lower. Well, I just kind of so like, oh, yeah, yeah. Easier to count. Yep, yep, yep. There we go. 31 packs, $50, looking for 52 or more. Mike Kretzer said he's done, but. We can say going once. Just maybe that'll entice him to get another bid in there. Oh, I didn't even need to do it. 52. Ah, Baseball. Baseball. He said, damn it. I know you, Mike. I know you're not going to just go out like that. So 32 packs, $52. Cat D says 55. Okay, there's the pack there. So what do I need? You need two more for, well... One more. Actually. It's really one more, yeah. Okay, I'm going to throw that one in here. And that's it. And then I'm just going to throw an extra pack in just for the fun of it. It's Tops Kids. Oh, look at that. Sticker pack. That's getting thrown in just for extra. Good luck. Good luck, pack. <laughs> Summer said, wow, got it. Brew while I went to get a drink. Six times four, 24, 25, 26, 27 packs and one kid's pack. If I win, can I get all baseball? No, this is what you get. <laughs> well, I, don't know. I, can, I would do that. If he wins, I'm, if he doesn't want hockey. And football? If he doesn't, I'll do all baseball. That's you fine. have enough? I'll see what I have. But Well, that's what I'm saying. I, what if you don't have enough? You're going to tell him you have enough and you don't have well, it? Well, he gets, if I don't have enough baseball, he gets the football. If he doesn't want hockey. what Do you not want hockey or football? I mean, if he wins, I mean... You just want whatever the you can't have all baseball. John doesn't have enough all baseball. I think I might. I might. How many do I need? You need to replace two, four, six, seven, ten, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen packs. Yeah, I have enough to cover it. And then you need uh, another five packs. I got enough to cover. I'm so good. Twenty two. I got okay. I got tons of football. I got tons of baseball. If he doesn't want hockey, that's fine. You can, yeah. If you don't want hockey, you can get it, Mike. You can get all baseball. All if you, baseball. If you if win, you, you can get all baseball if you want. Oh, Kathy's at fifty-five. Hold on. I didn't even switch. Yeah, well, she's leading, right? I didn't switch the the thing here. Anyway. All right, so Kathy's winning anyway. No, so not right now, Mike Kretz are sixty bucks. So you so, have two more packs. So, so I would have had 56, 58, 60. I owe three packs. Okay, that fifty-six is a one dollar bet. Yeah, but every two hour increments, well, that's what I'm, I'm, just, I'm staying yeah. in two hour increments. But it's not two dollars. But saying. I'm going to throw three packs. Okay, that's fine. Because that's what I would have done. Okay. So if they do sixty three, how many packs you throw in? All right. So we're right do. now we're at sixty. Okay. 30, 60. So sixty two, sixty four to if Cat so D is it's two more. Two so sixty three is two more packs. No, sixty five. She's at. She's at sixty three. That's a sixty five. Oh, 65? So she gets two Three. packs. <laughs> two dollar increments. And then you got a five dollar increment. Well, then you got three packs. <laughs> you just I'm good. Packs. I mean, right, right now we're even. Okay. Don't don't count how many you got there. All right. <laughs> Final call. 39 packs. With that kid's one? Yeah, counting the kids. So we have 38, and I threw an extra one in. Okay. 38 packs, $65 to Cat D, and then there's that one kid's one. Final call. Mike says he's out. <laughs> 65.50. I think I was right, guys. I'm on it. I'm, I got everything perfect. It was a three dollar bed, and you added two packs, and then it was a five dollar bed, and you added three packs. Because it was fifty five. If you get to fifty six, you add a pack. Then okay. fifty eight and sixty. So I did my two dollar increments. If someone would have bid a but, dollar, I would have added the pack. But then when she went up the higher over sixty five, I added two. Okay. Which because would have been she didn't get the sixty two. Yeah, she didn't get the fifty six. Okay. Oh, this is high finances. All right, we're at seventy. Cat D, what do you say? Why are you doing seventy? She wants more hockey packs. She she gets three more packs if she goes to seventy. 
Do you want to do 70? Because that gets you three more packs. Okay. Is that what I think that's what the idea was? I don't know what she's doing. I don't know what you're doing, and I don't know what she's doing. All right. At this point, if Cat D goes 70, she gets three more packs. Cat D's bidding against herself. You're making up. No, no, no. Cat D, 65 50 does not a bid. No, no. He, well, he was just messing around. He's talking about that. That was just messing around. So about you're about. good at 65 right now, Cat D. Cat yeah, D. yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Kathy, you're good at 65. No, now she says, yeah, that's fine, 70. Okay, well, then you have three more packs. Oh, my gosh. There we go. We're at 70. We're, we're right. I, I, okay. I, I got the math in my head. All right, John's got the math. Kathy, do you want to bid against yourself again? <laughs> my, my Kretzer's probably going to come back at 75. I don't know. At this point, we're, we're even right now with one extra pack. Okay. Did you put final call yet? Yeah, he's good. Yeah, okay. okay. All right, we're going to sell. So, so, so. Holy so, so, mackerel. So. You was, guys make fun of my math. That was crazy. Thank you, Cat D. Appreciate it. Thanks, Mike Kretzer. Thank you, guys. That was a good auction. $70 to Cat D. Uh, I don't know how many packs you got, Cat. It's like 100 39. packs. 39 packs, apparently. Something like that. <laughs> More around that area. Cat D. All right, Cat D. Thank you very much. Appreciate you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Congratulations. I put your name in the spinny wheel. Spinning wheel. Okay. Um, thank you, Cat D. Thank you, Cat. I don't know what I want to do. I want to do this tool lot. I don't know. I must do this tool lot at $14. Too. I got some heavy tools in there. Tool lot. $14. I, got one. I don't even know what that one uh, thing is. I might have to do it. Fireball shot. Oh my god, yeah, you definitely need one. Give Cat D one. Yeah, Cat D needs a fireball shot. <laughs> right, 39 ish plus or minus three or four, maybe. <laughs> That's what Mike Kretzer <laughs> said. Right, it's somewhere in there. Somewhere in that area. 39, 40 packs. All right, $14 starting bid. I might throw a couple extra packs in just for the I got a bunch of these. I don't know, really. Like, I know this is a hammer. It looks like a little, like, maybe tack hammer or something. It's kind of a weird little. Well, maybe for like, I don't know, like hammering out like um, like tin, maybe tin or iron or something like that. A little delicate work with this, with this pointy end. I don't know. It's got tape on the handle down here because it looks Attack like hammer. Tack hammer, yeah. Yep. A little split. Uh, you can you see that split? Okay. Splitting the wood. So we got that. I got some seal stuff. I don't know what this Stanley Carbide Grit Raw Sod. Did you put Cat D in the um, yep. poultry hammer at Championship? For thin straight cuts in ceramic, hardened steel, cast iron, and masonry. Or body work. Yeah. Yeah. New in the box or in the package. NOS. Stanley. I got another yeah, I got Cat, another one. Cat D's passed me a beer, boys. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Buck Brothers. I never a beer and a shot. A shot and a beer. Buck Brothers. I never heard of Buck Brothers. High speed steel axle. See, Buck Brothers, I thought was um, sold um, hunting stuff, but I don't know. Vintage Memories at sixteen. I don't know. What, I don't know what these are, but it's sealed in the. Oh no! You know what? This isn't sealed. This one isn't. The Stanley one is, but this one I just saw. They might have taken one out or something. Well, right. Two blades. All right. Is it two? Oh yeah. There's only one. There's in only one blade in the two blade pack. Two blade pack. All right. All see. Right. See. see? I caught it. Though. We caught it. All right. Well, I'm sure that there's probably 99, not, not 99 pieces in here. Uh, 99 tools, but this ain't one. I don't know what this is. Electrical home repair kit. Yeah. I have a home. I've never used any of these things in my You never spliced repair. a wire? No. Get out. No. That's for splicing wires. What would you need to splice it? Like when... Oh, this thing looks like it was never used. Yeah. it's That's a splicer. Do your wires need to be spliced often? Well, like, give you an example. Like, I fixed the lamp and I spliced the wires in and used the wire nuts to wire nut it shut. Oh. I thought you meant, like, when, when it says home, I think they meant, like, in the walls. Or in no, the, it's a home that's for your house. Yeah. You have electrical tape. You have a tester. You yeah, have you got a tester. You got a little... Look, you knife got knife wire nuts. It's, it's for your house. Wires? Bear flex. I could have used that wire stripper yesterday. Well, there you go. There. Maybe you'll need it tomorrow. Wire stripper. Brand new. Wire oh, stripper. That's a great kit. You got electrical tape. That's when you wrap the right, wires up right, before you yeah. put the 
the twisties on it as your tester to make sure you got everything sure right. The lamp works when you get it done. That's, oh, that's, look, you got some things here. These little things. Yeah, that's if you want to do like your stereo system and you want to put that little thing on the. That's that's the wire caps. Yeah. Oh, look, you got some zip ties. You can use these for other applications. And then you use those. Time. You use those orange ones. If you're selling like a cap gun on eBay, you put those little orange ones oh, on yeah, the end of the cap. Safety, right? Yeah, safety. Cap. Well, this is a heat thing. It yeah, it's a voltage yeah. tester. Yeah, that up. Oh, here's a good example. Back by silver. For a few examples, installing a ceiling fan with lights, outdoor floodlights, or new switches. There you go. That you need that. You need to you need to splice them together. <laughs> and James, remind me not to hire Mike to do electrical yeah. around my house. You wouldn't hire me because I wouldn't do it. I'd say call the electrical. Fair flag. That is a good set for your house. You That's a perfect set if you do any electrical work. There you go. Founding a storage tote. I got this wrench. It says Barcalo Buffalo USA. Barcalo Buffalo B A R C A L O Buffalo USA. All right. There's Three quarters and five eighths. There's a buffalo wrench. Buffalo wrench. Maybe you can hunt, hunt buffalo with it. I don't know what this is. A tap. It's a tap. It's yeah. a, a like a tap. Like if you're yeah. tapping something through a hole or something. Yeah. Made in the USA. Four two eight six one W F on it. I think maybe. There we go. We're having fun here. Where are we at here? We're at Mike Crutcher 18, looking for 20. I don't know what this thing is. It's got two. It's a punch. Uh, it's a hole punch. A hole two. punch. Yep. Hole punch. That's a screwdriver from round corners. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Vintage memories at 20. We got this. A couple sockets here. They yeah, it's a screwdriver. Here. Tai, this one says Taiwan on it. This one doesn't have a name. On it's it. a spark plug. Uh, oh yeah, this is yeah spark plug puller, right or whatever. Yeah. Vintage Mary says, "Can you throw in another Chinese coin?" <laughs> <laughs> Mike Crutcher twenty two. And then this one is an uh, impact one. C fourteen. Oh, it's got some name on it. Yeah, an angled Sorry. screwdriver. Yep, that's what I thought. No, it's got some name. I can't read it. It says say USA on it. I can't read what the name is. And you're getting, oh, you know, I need those things in here. What do you need? These? Those. I have some. Okay. I'll give you some. These I have like some. The I, your pegboard. Yeah, the pegboard. Yeah. I put all my but pictures there's on. There's a big one in here, too. I have. Like, there's a couple bigger hook, like, hook ones. It's a big But for, like, pegboard, you know, yep. for your yep. garage or your. Pegboard for garage or, like, like, an estate sale yeah. when you hang pictures up. I'll give you that. I have a. No, nah, I'm just messing no, with you. No, I do. I have, yeah. like, three of these. I know. I'm just messing with you. All right. So we have Mike Crutcher, 22, looking for 24. Yeah, tool lock, guys. One of these blades is out of here, so it's just one hacksaw blade. In there. I think I'm going to... That camera? Yeah, you used to save those for your antique booth. When you have, oh, you don't have pegboard, though. No, I don't have anywhere to put them. I just hang them. What, these? Yeah. I have that, like, wire shelf I could hang stuff from, so I don't really, like... Okay, Dennis Duke. We haven't heard from him in a little bit. That's Comes true. in at 25. 25, tool lot. Tool lot. There you go. Must be the 99 piece electrical home repair kit. Vintage Memories is out. Thank you, Vintage Memories. Thanks for being Vintage Memories. We're going to have some Pokemon coming up next. Oh, yeah, Pokemon. New in the packs. Got packs of Pokemon. And Crutcher. He's like, Crutcher goes, thanks, Dennis. I'm out. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so we're gonna say final call since everyone's out. You want to come back in? Yeah, let me start putting this back. If you want to jump back in, thank you, thank you, thank you. We're gonna do final call because we have a little bit of lag, guys. So if you want back in, sorry if I miss you. We'll, we'll make it right. I just the lag is really bad. Too a lot. I'm fire when ready. Man. We're going to sell it. Sold, sold, sold. 25 to Dennis Do. Dennis Do. Thank you, thank you, buddy. Thank you. Good deal, Dennis Do. Thank you, thank you. All right. We'll put that as this stuff. Just to break our floor because I'll put the key for it. Okay. All right, Dennis Do. Thank you. Thank you, Dennis. Congratulations to you. Let me get my 
spinny wheel up there. I don't know what to do first. Dennis, do. I do the packs or the other packs? Thank you. I think you should do the packs. Which one? These packs? The other packs. Um, I don't know. Do the other packs. Okay. Um, all right. So I know this is always confusing. All right. But we're doing choice. Of uh, Pokey Pokemon card booster packs. Booster packs. And we're starting the bid at twenty dollars. Your choice, one or two. It's choice. It's choice. We have two lots. So what we got is I'm doing it by the graphics. Right. There's some people collect right graphics. There's the four graphics. These are Pokemon Sword and Shield Battle Styles. New booster packs. But the graphics on these are get four different graphics. You get this guy. I don't know who they are. You get this guy. You get this guy. And this guy. And then some people just collect the artwork too. Mm -hmm. So each one of the packs has those four. So you can take one or two. There's four in each pack, and you have each one of the graphics in each one of the packs. Right. All right. So we got twenty to back by so. Remember, it's choice. Choice of one or two lots. Right. So double your bid if you want both. So you're getting four old open packs when you win. in each one of these. But there are sword and shield battle styles, Pokemon. Mm -hmm. But I kind of did the so you would have different graphics. New. Yeah. I mean, I, these are new guys. I mean, I, I just got these at the store. Luckily, I walked in. And they're 2021. They're brand new. And it's all four of the graphics that are shown. You get each one of the boxes. Have, I don't know what's in the packs. And, you know what I mean? I don't know if it's... If you get that same pack inside there, I don't know that. But your outside graphics. <laughs> Mike Kretzer says, I don't know anything about Pokemon. But back by Silver said, this is the newest English set. Okay. There we go. I don't know anything about it. I just, like I said, I went into the store. They were there. I figured, you know, I'll buy some because I know our our people wouldn't, or you know, come to our sales like these. Yeah, and I don't know anything about them either. Than they're very popular. I mean, I don't know these specific Pokemon no. in general are very popular. Diamond West, we already have. Uh, back by Silver in at twenty. We're looking for twenty twenty two. Make sure you're on live chat. In the chat, please. Okay. You got 22 to back by silver. Look, I mean, 20 to back by silver. Looking for 22. Diamond West is in at 22. Okay. Look, looking for 24 or more. And I was nice. I left some for other people. Mike Kretzer said, "Put a pack up so I could see it." Please. Okay. Like please. he did it. He did say, "Please." Okay. Here, here's what it looks like. The pack is inside here. It's like in a cardboard. It's in a cardboard. Uh, it's called shelf. a booster. It's called a booster uh, booster pack. I don't know if you can see that. Can you read that? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And it hangs on, you know, it's a booster pack. You get one pack per booster pack. But there's graphics on it. I know some people collect graphics. I, I don't know. Right. I just. It's what? the same group of card game or from it's the a same card game, game, but I'm saying I know people the collect outsides, I know yeah. people collect graphics. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, I watch YouTube on some Pokemon stuff and people collect the graphics on them. Mm -hmm. They when they open the packs, they save the packs and stuff. I don't right. know. I don't know who these people are or I don't even know what you can get in this set. If you get anything good, I mean it says oh, I'm sure there's you get a ten additional cards, you get codes one Pokemon T C G. Does that mean it's a hollow? I don't know. And then 10 know. additional cards. No. I don't, I, don't know. I don't know what that means. Includes one Pokemon TCG. No idea what TCG. Maybe back by silver knows what that means. 
Well, back by silver. Let's say uh, go once because Diamond West is uh, the winning bid here. So maybe you can uh, tell us if you're out or let us know what TCG means. <laughs> yeah, my cards said no thanks, no clue. I just they're cool. Yeah, Pokemon. Yeah, are, I, Pokemon are hot, man. And they're never at the store. No, you can never get them. They're never at the store. They're like baseball cards or whatever. I can't know, get any baseball cards at the store. Never get them. If I get them, I'll sell them. Right, but I'll sell them somebody. here because people know when they come um, out and they go in and buy them all. I mean, yeah, I mean, I could have bought them all, but I was nice and I left. You got to collect them all. But, I mean, I could have bought a bunch of these packs, no, of these booster packs. I left some for someone else. I just figured, you know what? I'll be nice. Maybe that will karma will come back and there will be baseball there. Or right. Yeah. You'll get lucky. Yeah. No, no. Yeah, Mike. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, Back by Silver says the Tyranitar card sells for 100 Wow. There you go. Maybe okay. you get that one in there. Maybe you get one. Okay. I have some more. Uh, I have just a preview coming up. I have a couple of these other. They have. They get you get one. Follow each one of these. So mm -hmm. they're coming up. Yeah, baseball and hockey cards are hot too. Yep, you're right. Yeah. All right. Final call. Den uh, Diamond West Robinson at twenty-two. And if there's no other interest, we're going to sell it. And see if he wants one or two. Yep. Diamond West. Did you sell it? Not yet. Nope. Diamond, Diamond, Diamond West sells it. a bit of sell. He's like, sell it, damn it. We got a little bit of a lag. And, I, you know, what's his name? Uh, Back by Silver didn't let me know if he's out. But we're going to sell it here in a minute and let us know if you want one, one or two. Doesn't look like Silver's in anymore. Two. All right. So, so, so. Two. All right, he wants a boat. He wants a boat, Diamond West. So that's okay. Forty-four dollars. You got it, Diamond. Thank you, Diamond. Thank you, thank you. I mean, if you guys wanted for me to keep looking for the stuff, I will. I mean, I'm assuming you guys. Right, know. each for twenty-two. Yes, yes. each for twenty-two. Yes, that's choice. Yeah, one or two, each for twenty-two. Yes. Thank you, thank you, Diamond West. I'll put your name into the twice spinning wheel, Diamond West. I'm in Wendy West. Yes. In the wheel twice. Thank you, Diamond West. Appreciate you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Do you want to do your paper? Um, you want to wait or do something else? Postcard? Ashtray? VHS? Uh, yeah, let's do the VHS. Let's get rid of these VHS. Oh, there's names in all Yeah, I was like, oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, have, I have it written down already, too. That's funny. VHS. <laughs> All right, well, VHS. I got a couple VHS tapes. Um, I'll start to bit of eight bucks. How's that sound? Lowest. Let's we go. Eight dollars. Okay. All right. All right. Cool. Cool. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I've got the Star Wars trilogy on VHS. Star Wars: Empire Strikes Back. The best one is the Empire Strikes Back. Return of the Jedi. In this box. Oh, there's something else in here. There's a, the envelope, please. I got a bunch Ooh. of magic cards coming in two oh, weeks. Oh, oh, it's magic? Yep. There you go. You got a Star Wars savings book. Savings book? Oh, it's like coupons for, for DVD or VHS. Pretty cool. I don't think they ever really opened this one. But you got, yeah, Star Wars... A new Jing, hope. Jing Leon says Magic the Gathering card sold for over half a million dollars of Black um, Lotus. Black Lotus. Wow. Oh, that's crazy. I know nothing about that stuff. I, I mean I've seen some I've seen some Pokemon cards go for three hundred thousand, you know. Wow. That's crazy. Wonder who the hell spent spending half a million dollars on. I don't know. Black Lotus. Someone is. All right, so we got the Star Wars trilogy and uh, Jaws. Remember Jaws? It's summertime. Yeah. You're getting wet, or you know, spring. Really? I didn't go in the water after this movie. Jaws, was part one and part two. I remember watching that movie and didn't get. I went to the beach right like a week afterwards, and yeah, I didn't get in the water. Damn it! We're gonna need a bigger boat. Yeah. <laughs> Anniversary collectors edition. 
universe on to this. Yeah, I don't know. Ed said, didn't he, didn't he think that a comic book sold for over a million? Wow, it's craziness. We got Christina to eat. There we go. Christina, appreciate you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Star Wars, a new hope doesn't want to get in there. Help us, Obi Wan. You're our only hope. <laughs> All right, we got Star Wars trilogy. It was funny as that movie came out. And we watched it, and we went to like the Outer Banks the week afterwards, and they're like, I, I would not get in the water. <laughs> You're like, what? I'm like, no way. This is watching to me now. I'm looking for I'm looking for body parts like on the beach fins. and fins in the water. Yeah, I'm like, you no way. Been that kid, like that kid, was messing with people with the fins oh, yeah. on his back. And then what's funny is, you done years that. later, we were down at the Outer Banks out swimming, and dolphins were out there. And oh, it was yeah. like, you could see and the it fins. Like, it was like, oh my god, right. Remember in the movie that kid had the yeah he back. faked them out yeah and they had guns on him and stuff out, <laughs> right, and just him messing around. All right, we can go once or whatever. All right, going go once. No Christina is at eight. Going once. Yeah, oh, Dingle Meow good. came at ten right after I oh, hit okay. going once. So we got ten. We're looking for twelve. Yeah, did they ever? Did they, they never did like a cheesy. Part two, did they? Oh, they did two, three, or four. They did? Jaws, yeah. yeah. Jaws 3D. You had to wear the, the, the oh, 3D God. glasses. I don't remember any of those. Yeah, like the, the Jaws it's came out of the water. Yeah, yeah. Cool. Jaws 3D. That would be kind of cool. But two and three, I bet, were terrible, right? Uh, they weren't the greatest, but Jaws 3D was cool if you got fired up and go because of the 3D. There's that, like... You some... just use a little scale there and... That... Yeah, <laughs> measure out. <laughs> There's some theme park where you, you know you can sit and watch a, one of those 3D movies, and they like there's a thing that missed you with water. Yeah. Like if there's something jumps out of the water, yeah, it like it, it missed you, and you think you're like getting wet, and yeah. it's coming in. Okay, Christina, twelve. I mean, that's like when we went to Rocky Horror. We brought toast, and you know, we when they toasted, we threw toast Both at the screen. Yeah. I mean, it was insane. Right. It was like, no, no. you know, and that's when there's like a hundred people, and everyone's throwing toast, and you know, it was just insane because it's. I'd cool. hate to have to clean that oh, no, clean no. that movie theater up afterwards. Right. Plus, everyone's all fired up. Right. It, was, it was a midnight showing. It's like okay, Bonds I got to bring toast. I got to bring. I had to remember right. everything to a bring. Flask. <laughs> my crits are three grams of fun. Three grams of fun. He's laughed my ass off at fatty. Look, they call me fatty. Who did? My Kretzer. Calling you fat. That's yeah. Not nice. I'm I am fat. I don't care. That's not nice. Mike, <laughs> Mike and I are right together. <laughs> right back at you, buddy. Right back at you. <laughs> see you now. Okay. Jingle Wing at 14, and we have uh, out. So we're going to see final call. One last night, Mike Kretzer. Yeah, it was a great auction. We had a good time. Yeah, I'm glad. Had a good, uh, even though I was fired up. Yeah, Johnny was on the fireball. Yeah, I had. I, I had. I was on the fireball. Oh, Fatty's a big joint. Oh, <laughs> okay, yeah, I thought okay. you were calling me Fatty. I thought you were calling him Fatty. Yeah, that's all right. All good here, Mike Kretzer. No problems. Okay, we got Jingle Man out 14. We went final call. No, 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 Mike. I I didn't take it that way anyway. Don't. I got you, brother. We're good. <laughs> I didn't take it as bad or nothing. All right, we can sell it if that's it. Okay, we're gonna sell it. Sold, sold, sold. Jingle me out at fourteen dollars. Thank you, Jingle me out. Appreciate you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, you did a good job, Mike. For a second time, you did a yeah, good job, man. We had a great time. Fun. I don't know if I could do that. <laughs> Mike, you're <funny. laughs> All right, Jingle Meow. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. 14 of you. Thank you. Yes. Put your name in the spinning wheel. Jingle Meow. 
we're going to do this exacto lot. Oh, exacto. Yeah, it's kind of cool with that. I mean, it's. Um, this is an exacto lot. Yeah, it is. Someone painted it over. But... I don't know when we start this at. Uh, start this at 14. Okay. I don't know anything about it, so. This is like an exacto. Um, right. Here's an exacto book. Exacto. Exacto. It's a little booklet. Looks like it's from 1970. Wow. I guess this is the, the parts you can get, knives, and tells you what you can get. Um, then I guess it shows you some, you know, stuff you can make. Well, that is cool. Oh, I'm very nice. And making a neckerchief. Oh, there's the little box I got. Or this one here. Here we go. That's the box we have here. So I don't know what's on. It's a number 86 exacto hobby chest. So there's the booklet. Here's a little bit of, there's a little shaver. Okay. Here's the little thing you put blades in. There's a little knife shitty thingy. I don't know what this is. It's missing a screw, but it, it says it's active on it. I don't know what this does. So I don't know what this does. You have other knives. These have the exacto name on them. This is another little nice exacto on it. This, this blade comes with it, but it looks like it's the same as exacto. Uh, that's another little knife that says exacto on it. I don't know what this is, but it says it on it. And then you have another little. This looks like it was in the little booklet. And you got all these little, all these pieces. And these have a Zacto on them, so I don't know what they do. They have a Zacto on them. You got all these blades here. Um, you got these things. I don't know what they do, but they have the Zacto. Oh, they're shavers or something. They're sharp. Stabby factor. Stabby factor. There's three of those. So it's a little little set. I mean, it's kind of cool. You're doing anything like with trains or something, I, I'm assuming. It's a whole set here. I'm trying to get it all back in. But this is a little shoot. I think he painted, whoever had these painted them the color so they knew. And all these blades here. Yeah, that's a cool set. It's a cool set. I mean, And the booklet, too. The booklet. Yes, yeah, booklets from 1970, but Mike, I found the set. Oh, it's in the booklet. Yeah, this, right there's the yeah, set. Yeah, that's cool. Because this, I didn't know where this went. This piece goes right here. Oh, yeah. And okay. the set. I don't know. There's this this knife, 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 ding, ding. It looks like it's pretty much all here. I don't know. Must be a blade missing or something here, but up top there. Oh, these blades—not all these blades go in here. These other pieces go in there. Yeah, maybe it's just set up. These pieces down here in the bottom—they're extra blades, but these pieces go in these little slots. By the picture here, I'm just won't go by the picture. Right, right, right. By the catalog, yeah. Yeah, the catalog cool. picture. But it looks like it's. And I'm there was like say patterns in there to do stuff with. Too. Yeah, I mean, there's something I saw. Right? Yeah, like yeah, that like, thing. yeah. yeah. Widowing a fish. There you go. You know, making a neckerchief slide. There you go. I don't know. But it looks like it's um, pretty much all there. Pretty cool. This isn't an exacto box, but someone painted over it. I can see the exacto logo on it. Logo there. on it. So, cool little set. Yeah, definitely cool. Someone that needs to, and I... Probably from the 70s if the book was the book says 1970. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Thirty dollars the Mike Kretzer looking for thirty two two two. If you do anything, if you do anything with that needs this kind of stuff, it's kind of mm -hmm. cool. Yeah, there's all. Yeah, I just found this today. 
So I've, I brought this today when I, when I came over this morning. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I found this at the warehouse. Oh, nice, nice. Because I'm cleaning that room off. I found this and went, damn, this is pretty yeah, cool. Yeah, that is pretty cool. Yeah. Because um, this booklet I had in the ephemeral. Oh, you did? And you I, were like, wait a second. Oh, wait a minute. It goes with the box. Right. That's cool. Yeah. Um, then it's doing 35, looking for 37. They're talking about uh, pot using it for pottery and and trimming molding. Well, I guess it would do it with stuff. trains, probably. Maybe train stuff. Yeah, I would assume the train stuff. It's a cool little lot. Christine cool said lot. you tripped over it in a room, actually. Uh, <laughs> not in the room of my house. This was at the warehouse. It well, actually, you know, with the button the room behind me where I sit. Uh huh. So I did trip over in the room. Right, right. That's what <laughs> so that is true. Christina knows you. Christina, uh, you were probably more right than you know. Yeah, you were more. Yeah, you're right. You you are right. <laughs> Is there a model number on that? Um, it would have been, if I'm going by this book, Mike's looking it up, so it, I, I, it makes me feel bad. Number 86, Hobby Chest. Hobby Chest. Mike's going to make me feel bad. No, I don't see it. But all the major parts are there for this set. $40 to Dennis. Mike Kretzer said, Dennis, do you have a train set up? <laughs> Dennis, Dennis just said yes. Yeah, I was going to say. Dennis, I, don't how, I don't know how far Dennis is from our uh, sale. Dennis said you need to stop by. Yeah, no, but I don't know how far it is. How far are you from? Fishersville, Virginia. Fishersville. Or our Staunton. Yeah, Staunton. It's, it's like one exit off uh -oh. from Staunton. I didn't sound good. That did not sound good. Something made a loud boom in the next room over. Christina, well, I don't have any cameras this time. We'll worry about that later. $40 to Dennis do. Looking for $42. Two, two. I tried to find cameras. Well, I do have one camera. Who oh, no. Dennis is an hour, or no, Fishersville is an hour from Roanoke, or Dennis is an hour from Roanoke? Know. Dennis is closer when I go to uh, Hillsville, Virginia. Christina, I can throw a camera in my house lot. There you go. I have one extra one in here. I'm throwing one in. Do it. She asked for a camera. She sure did. I'm going to throw one in. All right, 40 to Dennis. Going once. And Mike Kretzer says he's out. Because he will probably use it before me. Whoops. I typed once wrong. Once. Has an N in it, apparently. Really? <laughs> 40 to Dennis. Looking for 42, 2, 2. Have you been drinking? Yes. I've been <laughs> That's drinking. That's the excuse you use. Yes, I'm using it. That N key got stuck there. I'm just glad we have a new battery charger tonight. <laughs> I don't have to worry about it. All right. Dennis at 40, looking for 4222. Mike Kretzer is out. Now we can't spell cat defense. Uh, we could never spell, really. We're just cutting and pasting. <laughs> with, we're cutting and pasting with an exacto set. Forty dollars to Dennis, looking for forty-two or more. Or if there's no other interest, we're going to sell it to Mister Dennis. Do a no, loud no, boom? Is it a ghost? I don't know. No ghost. You had the ghost detector. We don't have no. Ghost. We. I did have the ghost detector at one time. Christine but what happens if a ghost came in? Like. Wouldn't you think a ghost would know that I have the ghost detector? He left and left. Like Casper and I'm came out here. out and came back. Sell it. Sold, sold, sold. That is due forty dollars. Goes with your tool lot. Thank you, Dennis. Goes with your tool lot. And what would you like to do next, sir? Um. Hmm. Ashtrays. Yeah, let's do some ashtrays. Ashtrays. Let's let's try to get rid of all my ashtrays tonight. What do you think? Oh my god. You think I can get rid of them? I own it now. The go a ghost came with that lot, she said. <laughs> you own it now. All right. Ashtray lot. Let's we'll start at ten on this one. Because I want to try to get rid of them. A lot of ashtrays. And at every Don't make it hard on me. Four dollars. Every four dollars. Every four dollars you're gonna add one. Starting bid. Okay. So Is that let, easy? Me, let me keep it straight. Ten. And then 14. But if add. someone bids 13, and once you pass 14, you add one. As you said, every four. Every four dollars, right. Right. So if someone bids 17, 
That's another asterisk? Yes. What if they've been 16? Then they only get one. <laughs> I'm just I'll trying to make, I'm trying to make sure I understand. Starting bid, ten bucks. Okay. You want to get rid of them anyway? I do want to get rid of them. <laughs> That's your bids fourteen right off the bat. <laughs> I think so. Is that a bid? Is that a bid, Mike? Oops. I'm going to say it's a bid. What did you start? With? <laughs> ten. ten. <laughs> so you got to add one. Well, I don't ask what that's really a bid because he put it in before I listed the thing. Mike Kretcher, is that really a bid? <laughs> he, I mean, I didn't even type it in yet, and there's fourteen came up. All right, first up, course. Yes, it's a bid. Okay. So you're adding uh, one already. It's got a little, I don't know if this camera can pick it up. It's got a little, um, it's not a crack in the, in the ashtray itself, but like in the pottery, like the crazing. It's cracking. crazy. It's yeah. crazy. Yeah. Can you see that in there? Can yeah. You see it's, it in the yep. Camera? Right there. It's crazy. That's fine. Yeah. I mean, it's not a crack in the ashtray. It's fine. But the, the paint or whatever. I don't know. Whatever. So I got the cores. I got a Kieran beer. <laughs> <laughs> this one's a cool one. Right inside. That one says, what if I bid 1650? Get I guess it's up to John. I, John has control. Of I that. have control of it. Right now, we're adding one more. Okay. We got this. So we're at 14. Beer and beer one made in uh, Japan. It says on the bottom. In Japan. Okay. I got a couple. Um, what is this? Uh, Las Vegas Desert Inn and Country Club. Las Vegas, Nevada. It's got a little dust on it. No extra charge. For the the problem with Christine, he started at 10, so it's going to throw it off. So you're going to go with four. He's going to, you're going to go 10, 14, 18, 22 because he started at 10. Las Vegas Hilton. Ashtray, a little dusty. I'll wipe it out for you. And then the Flamingo Hilton and Tower. I think I had, maybe I had two of these because I thought we saw one of these the other night. Yeah, I think you did too. Okay. And then I don't know what, this is the extra one. So there's five we started with there. There's the five. Okay. And then I don't know if this is a, uh, if this is a hotel or what this logo is for, but it's like a smoky glass, charcoal gray color, and then it's got this logo. I don't know what this logo is. I don't either. It's the orange on the bottom. But that's the <laughs> sixth one. All right, so we've got added 16. We're looking for 18. Once we get to 18, we'll add another one. I'm under control here. Right, I'm going to get something. Oh, here. Okay, we got Mike Crutcher 18. You're going to add one. Gonna add one. There we go. This is a uh, international one, I guess. It's got a little. I have to. I have to wipe it. It's a little dirty. This one, but it's. I don't know. Some some. Something rude in and Paris. In Paris. It's like a restaurant, right? Oh uh, yeah. A Manguin Versailles. Yeah, I don't know. Some kind of restaurant in Paris. There, I don't know. This there we go. France, B and C, France. Limoges? Is that say Limoges, yeah, France? Limoges, France. That's good China. Yeah, Paris. Yeah. All right. So that's the seventh one. Okay, we got Ed Champion at twenty. We're looking for twenty-two. We get to twenty-two, we add another ashtray. Take one down. All right, Mike Crusher's at twenty-two. We got to add an ashtray. So then we've got this Cinzano Vermouth. Ooh, Cinzano? I might be saying it wrong. Cinzano? And this know. is made in Italy. I don't know. Vermouth. Vermouth. It's Vermouth. a triangle. So that's number uh, eight, right? Number eight. We're good right uh, now. We're right. looking at Mike Crusher 22, looking for 24 or more. We get to 26 or 30. We'll add two. We get to 30. We get to 26. We add another one. Right. All right. Let me run. Let me run. Uh-oh. I'll be right back. He's running. I'm running. In my onesie. Oh. At, bring another one with you. Okay, he's going to bring a whole bunch. We, we got to add another one because Mike Crutcher's at 26. 26 gets another one. Mike's running. Can you imagine him running in a onesie? That's funny. Damn Grinch onesie. Mike Crutcher, 26, looking for 28 or more. We get to 30, we add another one. We're going to add another one soon as, uh, as soon as Mike gets back. Yeah, the pizza guy was pretty cool. Okay. All right, I'm back. We got to add one so okay. far. We get, well, you're adding two now. Okay. Mike Crutcher's at 30. This next one is LaSalle College. LaSalle College is in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. It's in the Olney section of Philadelphia. 
Only used to be a nice section, but much, much like Temple, you would never, ever want to go there now. Yeah. Uh, never go to any of the colleges in Pennsylvania or in Philadelphia. Just don't go to Philadelphia, basically, right? LaSalle, very cool. My father went to LaSalle. All right. College, so There's we, one we add, and we're going to add one more. One more. And Summer says up. she likes the triangle. Yeah, it's pretty cool, right? I don't know if you can tell where this one's from. But they were maybe Cape May, times. maybe Cape May, New Jersey. I'm just, I'm just taking a big guess at Cape May. And this says Nanco, which I think is a decent brand. Nanco, N A N C O. I've heard of it. I've heard of it, and I don't know where I've heard of it from. So we've got 10 ashtrays right now, right? We're at $30, something for 32 or more. We get to 34, we add another ashtray. I'll show you a 34 rad one <laughs> and champion. This is the heck is that? Some kind of it's in a different language, so it's some kind of building in I'm assuming German. It's Wiesbaden, Wiesbaden, Nose, Karamas. I don't know. It's a German. You probably can't pick up the word. All right, there. we're at 38. You're gonna add another one. Okay. Very good. A little dirty. I'll, I'll have to wipe this one off. I like the color on it. Yeah, there. it's pretty cool. It's got the blue. All right, one more. One more. We're at 38. Looking for 40 or 42. I don't know what this is. Shea Odette. New Hope. Is that one in Pennsylvania? Maybe Pennsylvania. W. That's a homemader. Jacobson. Someone made it in New Hope. Jacobson, New Hope. I don't know. There you go. 12, right? We're at 38. Looking for 40. If we get to 42, we add another one. So we have Mike Crutcher, 38, looking for 40 or more. Okay, we got Ed Champion of 40, looking for 42. We get to 42, we add another one. Mike Crutcher, 42, we're adding another one. All right, I got this. Uh, it looks like it, it would be homemade, but I don't think it is. I think this is how you would find, like, a ashtray. Um, in Guatemala. In Guatemala from the Camino Real... Guatemala Hotel. That's pretty cool, right? It's got a little place to stub out your butts, too. And then Can yeah. you show the pizza guy up, up close a little bit? Pizza guy? Yeah. Yeah, it's a little dirty, though. Don't don't ding me on the dirt. I got to wipe it He's got to clean the dirt out. It was in a box that was... I'll wipe it for you. So we're at 42 to Mike Crutcher. We added that one. So we are going to ask this. Is that good? Is yeah, that, the Mike Crutcher will ask for it. That's, okay. I think that was good. So we're at 42, looking for 44 or more. Once we get to 46, we'll add another one. So we're at champion 46, add another one. All right, so this says uh, Rome, Fountain of Trevi, I guess, is, that the, is the picture at the top. And it okay. says, while I was in Rome, I thought of you and this souvenir I bring to you. Okay. And it's got a cool little, uh, you know, like floral yeah. scallop. Well, my crutcher's at 50. You're going to add another one. Okay, we add another one. I guess I should keep it down to three. So can... How about this one is Niagara Falls, Canada. And they've got different, like, this is the tower. This is the Rainbow Bridge you go over. Marineland, Table Rock, Made in the Mist, the little um, That's where boat. the boat is. Yeah, the yeah. Boat. And it's got a cool little, like. Scalp edge. Yeah, and it's got a little gold. Okay, Ed Champions is 55, so you're going to add another one. Okay. Um, this one has a little fading. Uh, but it's oh no it doesn't I thought it was fading um this one is good I'm sorry I thought it was fading uh, it's I L Il Pastio I don't know Piccolo's homemade pasta I don't know guys if you, I can't read the Il Pastio Pastio okay, I don't know so we were 54 50 and this is Newcastle PA so. okay so we're at 60 you're gonna add one more. Because it would have been 58, and then if we get to 62, we add another one. So add one more. Okay. So this one is the one that's faded. I'm sorry. This one up here, the, the writing is a little worn away there. Okay. We got 62. So you're going to add another one. Okay. Then I'm going to get – I've got to count now. Cause okay. Right. Good, because i got to run. And get, I, might, I might be close to being out. Hold on. This is some galleries in Lafayette, Paris. And Limoges, France. Limoges, France. Yeah, I got it. I'll be right back. 
You got to add like nine more. No. Yes, they do. I'm at a hundred and cat D. Stop a second. He's got to go get more ashtrays. We're at a hundred to cat D. Just so you know. So it's 62. We were adding another one. And then I got to add nine more because cat D came in at a hundred. So that would have been 66, 70, 74, 78, 82, 86, 90, 94, 98, which is nine more we're going to add. So we're at 98, 102, we added the next one. So we're at nine more we're going to add. No more bids yet right now. We're at 100 at Cad D. Mike's got to make sure we have enough to cover them all. I do, but I just want to get through because I don't want to get jump the guns. Though. Okay, so we're right now we're going to add nine. All right, hang on. So we need, we got 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 16, 17, and then we'd be at 26 after. Yes, okay. we've got to add 9. All right, so I've got this. Oops, i got this. So we're going to add the 9 first, guys, before we bid any more bidding. Just hang on. Just hang tight for a second. I've got more. Just hang tight. Maxim Hotel, Casino, Las Vegas. That's oh, that's cool. I like that right there. That's a good, good shot right there. All right, so that's one. Um... I got this older. I think I sold one of these before already. This is a Holiday Inn. It's gonna be a little hard to see the. It's like pebbled glass and Holiday Inn logo on that side. Holiday logo okay, on that there we side. Go. So that's two. I've got another one of these Guatemala, but this is Hotel Biltmore in Guatemala. So it's very Guatemala. similar to that other one. Was, but that's a different. Reality. It's a different hotel. It's a different hotel, but it's Guatemala. So that's three. I've got uh, Intercontinental Hotels. I don't know. It's got a big, like, it looks like the US, the Gamecock uh, you know, yeah, mascot yeah, yeah. for football. And this is uh, Germany. This one's Germany. Okay. That's so four. That's four. <laughs> and then uh, ooh, oh, I'm just kidding. I got a plain one. <laughs> Sorry. There's nothing on this one. Just pebbled glass. But it's like, what do they call Hobnail? Hobnail. Maybe yeah. Hobnail. I don't know. It's plain. There you go. It's five, right? Yeah. Right? Yep. One, two, three, four, five, yeah. Another Intercontinental Hotels one with an M on it. I don't know why I don't think I need that anymore. Uh, Nicaragua. Look at that. Just just till we get just caught up here, and then we'll bid. Caught up. Hold we're, on. we're just gonna get caught up till we get caught up. Or else because I can't grab like nine at a clip and then because I am getting I am getting down to the end. Hang on or close to the end, at least. Hang on. And that was six, so you gotta add six, three six, more yet. Well. Yep. Um, I got this Holmes Hotel. Holmes, like not like Johnny Holmes. There's Holmes. I hope so, not. And this is from Bavaria, Germany as well. It's got a, it's got a cool and that's little, seven. Seven. So two more, <laughs> and then we're we can go back to bidding. I got this big huge bicentennial. 1776 to 1976, 200 years of progress. Huge, this thing is. Huge. This one's take up, it'll take up half the table here compared to the other one. And then one more is uh, the Fountain Blue. I wish this was looked a little bit better, uh, but it's the Fountain Blue Hotel. It's 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 faded a little bit up there, right? Fountain, oh, Fountain Air Blue. Yeah, or something like that. No, Fountain, F -A -F -A, no, Fontaine Blue. I don't know. It's some Miami Beach hotel, but it's it's faded a little bit there. Okay, so we're, we're, we're back into order now. We're at Cat D at 100, looking okay. for 102. Okay. Because we hit 102, we add another one. Okay. I'm, just, sure, I'm sure we probably will, right? Okay, I'm not just <laughs> saying where we're at here. That catches us up to, we're right to where it, 98. So we. Every four, 102 adds another one. So we're at 100 to Cat D, looking for 102. Vintage Memories is 102, so we add another one. Mike's getting another one. Here we go. Hang, 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 two. Oh, I got one over here. Okay. Oh, I got two over here. All right. So I got one for uh, Crystal Cave in Pennsylvania, Allentown, between Allentown and Redding. And it's like a brown. Okay, Ed, Vintage Memories came in before you at 102. Okay, so we got to add two more. Ed Cham is at 110, so it would have been 106, 110. So we add two more. So right. we got two more coming, guys. I've got this. Hold on, where's my paper? I've got my Diplomat Resorts 
and Country Club. Oh, there you go. That's probably really good. There you go. Right there. That's good right there. But it's like a yellow amber glass. Diplomats Resort to Country Club, Hollywood by the Sea, Florida. Is that one name of a place? Like, that's a sea? Yeah. Hollywood yeah. by the Sea? Okay, there were the two we added, right? Okay, yep. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we Cat D came in at one fifteen, so we added one more. Okay, and then I have this Canada looks very similar to the Crystal Cave one, but it's Canada with a big moose with on it. With a big moose on it. And it does say Japan. Japan on it. The A is missing, but it's Japan. You'll see. Okay. You'll see it down there. So one Okay, we had Ed Champion at one seventeen, but we we need one eighteen before we add another one. Okay. Let me just make sure I've got straight. So we got Ed Champion at 117, looking for 119 or more. Once we get to 118, we'll add another one. So we got to go two dollars. Okay, vintage memories. Okay, we got 118. So you're gonna add another one. Okay. So we got 22, 26. You're gonna add three more. Okay, hang on, hang on, hang on. I got A H. I don't know. I'm assuming it's a hotel, A hotels or A H, but this is from. I want to say Greece. Is that Iona Hellas? Yeah, I think that's Greece. Probably Greece, right? right. Okay, that's the one to cover the 118. We have 122, 126. So you got two more to go. Renser, I have no idea. It's all, it, it looks like maybe some kind of alcohol. Rents, Renser, okay. maybe a, uh, just a drink. I'm going to add these. We're going to let you add these two first. One more, right? You got to add one more, and then you're going to add more. I got this little Irish guy. Irish. Uh, hold on, wait one second. Wait, wait, wait one second. Hold on, wait, wait, wait. Come on. Okay, we lost. We oh, lost. No, I know, I know. Hang on. Just oh, hang okay, on. okay. You scared me. Yep, no, it's okay. We're good. Okay, it's coming back. Here it comes. We good? Yeah. Okay. It's well. That's coming back. Okay. Here we go. We got it right. You can see on the screen. Yes. Yep, okay. This is an Ireland, so this is the two, right? Made in Ireland, Irish porcelain. Okay, that caught caught us up, right? right yep. Mm -hmm. Okay, we got to add two more. Two more. Okay. Um, okay, so we had one twenty eight, one twenty six would have gave us another one. One thirty. Okay, hold on now. Twenty two, twenty six, one thirty, one thirty four, one thirty eight. I need three more. Three. Yep. Three more. Okay, we got three more coming. I got this diplomat's another one. There was a diplomat, a yellow one over here. Yeah, but that's a different but one. This yeah. is a white one, Diplomat Hotel, Hollywood by the Sea. Oh, sorry, Diplomat Resorts and Country Club, Hollywood by the Sea, Florida. And this is Royal China Incorporated. Okay. And then I need one more? Two more. Oh, two more. <laughs> um, the got, camera, he was doing something with the camera. It's back now, it's guys. Back, yeah. I know we have a lag. So we're going to add. Oh, wait. Oh, hold on, hold on. I see what they're saying. Hold oh. On. It's landscape. No, I'm sorry. Hold on. That's it. What are you doing? Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, hold your ears. Hey, get me off the screen. There we go. Okay. Oh, we're back. We're back. Okay. Sorry about that. So he's going to add two more, guys, because we're at 140 to add champion. So he's going to add these two. I was trying to raise it up a little bit. Uh, I know what you're saying. Okay, I know I was what trying doing. to do this so we can get them all in the frame. Yeah, but I don't but know I don't if that's happening. Going to, yeah. Okay. Okay. Two more? Two more. All right. Another one of these Kieran Beer ones. So you get two of these. Kieran Beer with the, uh, Asian writing on it from Made in Japan. Okay. You got to add this one. And then I've got this cool um, Order of the Eastern Star. Nottingham chapter number 246. Yeah, that's like a Masonic one. Masonic, yeah. Okay, you got to add another one now. Vintage Memories in at 142. One more? You got to add one more and then we're caught up. All right. All right, hold on. Hold on. Mike's going to find one more. All right, hang on. Hang on, I'm getting there. I'm getting there. Oh, okay. Wait, let me grab another one just in case. Hold on. So we don't get. I don't know. We're at 142 to Vintage Memories. Uh, I need my paper. I need oh. your paper. You need your paper. Broadway. Broadway. Yep. Is that like Broadway, like, like New, New York? York? Maybe. 
There's a Broadway asteroid. Okay, that takes us to 142 to vintage memories. Okay. We're all caught up. So we're looking for 146. I didn't even do long one shit. <laughs> it's just like crazy. We got Ed Champion at 144. We've got to wait till we get to 146 to add one. So 144. I did go in once just to, right? Okay, fine. You know, we'll go along. 146. Add one more. All right. I got this one with a box too. It's a uh, Briar's Ice Cream 85th Anniversary 1866 to 1951. <laughs> It comes. Oh, sorry. It comes with the box. The box has a little rip to it, though. No, I think she was uh, Mike Kretzer. I think she was saying that the Masonic is number two forty-two. Briar's ice cream in a box. All right, so we're at one forty-six. Looking for one forty-eight. We get to one fifty. We add another one. I'm almost out, boys and girls. We're almost out of. So we got 146 to Vintage Memories. It said going once, just so you guys know. Okay, we have 148. We get to 150, we add another one. So we're at 148 dead champion. You have to pull that one. Yeah, I will. Yeah, I'm going to turn a couple of So we're at 148. Vintage Memories at 150. You're going to add one. All right. I'm going to add this uh, Bookbinders restaurant. If Philly Picker's still here, he knows Bookbinders. Was, I think it's closed now, but they used to be all over the place. Bookbinders in Walnut Street, Philadelphia. Okay. That's 150. 154 adds another one. Let me see something. Can you get me out of here? Nope. I just need to... Um, So we got vintage memories of 150, looking for 152 or more. Oh, I know what you're going. Mm -hmm. 152, looking for 154. 154 gets us uh, another ashtray. One fifty four, you're gonna add one. That's going for it. So we're uh, I thought, hold on a second, hold on. I'm gonna add one then. What one was it? This one, that one, and uh, what was the other one? That golf. No, I only have the Megan Express, the Deville, and what was the other one? Okay. That's going for it. Okay. okay. So we're adding one then okay. when you're done. Oh, I left my paper here. One fifty eight. So we're gonna add two. All right. Riding two, one fifty eight. Okay. Riding two. First is this Lions Club. I hope you can see this one. Uh you need to get me back on this other side. Oh, you? that's right, because you're not seeing it. Oh, you can see it. I yeah. can see it there, yeah. yeah. The land it's a Lions Club, Land of Down East Hospitality, District forty one, which is New York and it says New York Convention at the bottom, nineteen fifty nine. That's cool. And then one more. One more. How about a really good one? Check this one out. I think it's good. The Stardust Hotel and Casino. Wow, what oh, look at the star. That's cool. Stardust, there you go. That is cool. The Stardust. That's probably not around anymore. I don't think so. So we're 158. Looking for 160. 162. We're adding another one. All right, we're good, right? And each memory is at 162. We're adding one more yet. Add one more. Okay. Yep. Um, I don't know what this is. Omar. Oh, let me the paper. Omar Katam's. I don't know. Some San Francisco. 
I don't know. It says San Francisco. Maybe it was a restaurant. I don't know. I mean, they got food like up on a platter. Yeah, looks Same. like it. That's cool. Yellow. Yellow. That covers the 162. We're looking for 164 or more. We get to 166. We add another one. We're at 162 to Vintage Memories. Uh, it's between Ed Champion and... <laughs> I was... Someone wake me up after we're done these ash trees. <laughs> I'm snoozing. We're almost there, Diamond West. We're very close to the we're, end. We're very close because he's going to run out. I'm going to run out. I'm not going to have. I'm not going to have any more. What you'll be thinking, you were going to be rid of those. One sixty-two. I'm going to hit final call. We're getting down there. Stuff's falling everywhere. Stuff's falling. Caught the wampus. We got a bad lag tonight. I don't know. Final call. Just okay. One sixty four. We're looking for one sixty six. Once we get to one sixty six, we add one. Ed Champs is one sixty four. It's gonna take you two days to wrap them no, up. No, sir. Ed got a how many last time? So they all got <laughs> there. Got, what forty eight? The last forty eight. The last time they all got there, nice and safe. In like two days. In two UPS. days. UPS. So we got Ed Champion 164, looking for 166. Once we get to 166, 166 of any memory, we're going to add another one. Oh. Yep, 166. Vintage memories, I got a really cool golf, that. golf. Golf. Now it is a little, you can see the, the logo. We got 168, little, we're looking for 170. A little faded there on the Miami on the Beach, logo. Florida. But it is Miami Beach, and it is a golf. And thank you for bidding 168. This is a good good auction. All right, we're at 168, looking for 170. 170 to Vintage Memories. Add another one. Yes. Yes. I got another. Now, the other Las Vegas Hilton one I had has white lettering. This one down here. Now you the got one it. in my hand has a gold lettering. I don't know what the difference is or why one is maybe just year, different years or whatever. Oh, it's hard to see. Hold on, let me put this camera back down. But here's the it's a Las Vegas Hilton. There's a little wear. Hold on, hold on. Okay, we're at 170. We're at 178. We got to add two. All right, that's it. This is the last two. That's it, the last two. All right, guys, 178. Got it. This is the last two coming up. Well, we got to have people. We got to have people. Uh, I'm just saying, this is the 178. We have. This, gonna, is this is it. And then you can keep bidding. You can I keep bidding. Like it's, over, but it's not over. You can keep bidding. It just. This, might, this is it. That's not the one of the last two. You just showed that. We got to add right. two more. And th these two are the last, the last two. two are coming right here, guys. Yeah. We're out of ashtrays. We're 178. You can keep bidding, but we're done with ashtrays. We have no more to add. He's out. This is a Naval Academy. I know it's probably hard to see the logo. but Yeah, okay. Naval Academy. I'm reading it. Yeah. Oh, can you read it? Okay. Yep. U.S. Naval Academy. Yep. US this Naval. is the one. That, this is one of the two. One of the two. T&J Pottery, Baltimore, Maryland. Okay. And we're going to add another one here, and he's out. This, so this is probably the coolest one I have. I saved it for last. Look at the Pegasus, dude. This look is at that, great guys. Too, man. This look is at that. Really Mobile Oil, Camp Hill, PA, which is right up. No, Chapel Hill. Our Chapel Hill no, is in Burn, North Burn, Carolina. Burn Athens, PA. I'm oh, sorry. It Burn Athens. Says Chapel Hill, Chapel Hill, twelve ninety three. I don't know what that means. I think that's the phone number, right? Like it looks CH like yeah, 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 yeah. So. That's the last That's ashtray the last we can one. add. And I'm counting about how many we have. Uh, it doesn't really matter. You're out. At this point, we got Vintage Memories of 184. Looking for 186. Ed Champion 186. Looking for 188. We just, we're, just don't have any more ashtrays to add. I don't have any more. All the ashtrays are going. All the leaves are burnt. All the ashtrays are gone. Is that on the table or not? You got them all out? I'm pretty sure. Okay, I'm just making sure. I mean, I don't want to... I'm pretty sure. That's it. That's it. For the ashtrays, guys. I mean, I only had six boxes, and you guys bought, you got bought them all. all I all. mean, we weren't expecting to go like this, but hey, <laughs> thank you guys for bidding. So we got vintage members at 188. Okay. Looking for 190. <laughs> and it's like add hockey cards. <laughs> yeah, I could go to my house. I probably can find some uh, ashtrays at my house. 
If I find, I'm looking, man. I don't think Mike's I have. looking. If we have any more, we'll add them. He's just looking for. I doubt it because I think I went through all of these. I think need I'm to run to the garage. I can check one more time in there, but Mike's gonna run to the garage and make sure there's no more ashtrays. If we are, we'll add them. I mean, I don't. I mean, I. Mike got wiped out of ashtrays. So he's looking. We're at 192 to Vintage Memories. Looking for 194. If he finds any, we'll add him, guys. Nice lot of ashtrays. I got one more, but it's probably not an ashtray. All right. He found one. We don't know it's if it's like an ashtray. It's a little uh, tray. Like, it's not. It doesn't have the ridges. Like, it has ridges on it, but not. It is the Shell Shell Ron Shell Mon Sheltonham East of Broad Street. So this is probably. I don't know, but you're throwing it in. I'm throwing it in. Whatever it is, you can have it in there too. All right, Whatever you're adding works. that one in. All right, we got 196 to Ed Champion. Looking for 198 or more. It's pretty much between Ed and Vintage Memories. So, whoever. So we got Vintage Memories at 198. Looking for 200. Since we did Final Call, whoever goes out, we're going to sell. It's an ashtray. Yep. We go. We found another one. Look at this. A part of trees in a pear tree. It is a quail. It's a quail. Ashtray. Made in Japan. Look at that. That's getting thrown in. Ideal. Show, show it again just make sure they can see, see where the, the spots where they put the cigarettes. Oh, yeah. Yeah, right there. You put cigarettes in it. There we go. Okay, we're at 200, and Vintage Memory said she's out. Oh, well, I just added this one. Maybe we're going to add. Did thing. you see that one? We're adding the quail. Vintage Memories, we're adding the quail. So I'm going to sell it now that Vintage Memory said she was out. Just to make sure, make sure she saw that one. Right, I just want to make sure you saw the quail vintage memories. We added that one. We found that one. So I'm going to wait. How many total? I don't know. Oh, uh, we're going to. I'll count while you wait. All right, we're waiting. He's counting. Four, six, eight, nine, ten, this is ten. Okay. Two, four. <laughs> Forty-six. Forty-six. She saw it. She's out. Okay, that's we're gonna that's sell. Right. I just want to make sure. Sell, sold, sold. Ed Champion for two hundred dollars. Nice. Thank you, Ed. Uh, thank you, thank you, thank you. Good auction, guys. Good auction. Thank you, guys. Let me just give me one minute here to. Well, how am I gonna follow up with that? Pull these off the table. I gotta collect ashtrays. <laughs> I gotta go find ashtrays now. Mike's pulling off the table here, guys. Just give me one minute. I don't Congrats, Ed. Minute. Thank you, Vintage Memories. Also, Thank you, you, vintage you memories, guys yeah. are awesome. I go to my my silly uh, Pokemon cards next. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, let me get. Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, maybe I'll do that house lot next. All right, Ed. Thank you, buddy. Appreciate you. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Yeah, we'll do this. I did Pokemon last time. I'll do this. Did I do Pokemon last time? Oh, I did my exacto. Exacto. Ah. 
We'll do the phone meeting after this. This is going to be a house lot. All right, hang on. Hang on. Thank you, Ed. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Ed. It's hot in this onesie, Ed. I picked the wrong night to wear the onesie. Thank you very much, Ed. Appreciate you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I will put your name in the spinning wheel. Ed Champion. All right. Thank you, sir. Thank you very much. Thank you to Vintage Memories as well. Thank you, thank you. All right. John's got a house lot. What are we starting to bid again? $14. House lot number two. Starting bid 14. Okay. First of all, we're going to start off with this camera. I even, it's a Fuji film camera. It's in the box. It's in the box. I don't know. There's it. Boom. There it is. Oh, yeah. That's a cool one. Battery department looks good. Battery. Just wanted to show the battery department. I don't know if we're filming here or not. We'll see. Uh, Bruce, Jingle Meow beat you at uh, just a minute there. And then Mike Kretzer came in at 16, so we're looking for 18. So we got a Fuji camera. I'm going to throw the battery in. The battery's no good. Okay. We got this cool roast meat thermometer. Roast meat thermometer. Oh, yes. Boom. Look at that thing. Instructions, everything. Pretty cool. In the original box. And we got this cool wallet. Look at this. Brand new wallet. It's from George. Letter trifold chain wallet. Doesn't have a chain, but it looks like it's brand new. Never used. Look at that big skull on it. Pretty cool. Blue to be one thing, Mike. You, you look at it. It's pretty yeah, cool. it looks. It's I mean, it's new. got the tag inside, yeah, or like whatever the label, paper, paper label, or That's whatever. A cool little thing. Look at this little devil thing. Look at this guy. I don't know if it was juicing or something. I don't know. Pretty cool little guy. Okay, we got a couple of thimbles. Gettysburg. Oh, yeah. Two of the same with cannons. One one has the, the flag you can't sell no more. Oh, uh, yeah. You sure can't, my friend. And then got cannons on these, Gettysburg PA. There's three of those, three, three thimbles. You got this cool Reno keychain. Reno Nevada, I'm sure. Yep. You got a mustard tin. Oh, it's full of mustard tin, too. Let's see. Oh, it's full. Look at that. You want mustard? You got it. And we got this little hook here. I don't know. It's, it's some lady brass. That says something on it, but I don't know what it says. Uh, coat hook or something. Ad oh, hook. yeah, yeah. And we got a Statue of Liberty, 100 years belt buckle. 1886 to 1986. Boom. That is pretty cool. And we got um, some other keychain here, tequila. Oh, to kill you. Little keychain, horseshoe. I think this was an old curler, like an old curler when you did hair. I don't know. <clears throat> it's in this lot. <laughs> I'm not cleaning that straight. No. Can we say the name of that? Wallet again, please. I think it was George. Wasn't it? I think George. George. I don't know. I've never heard of George before. Me neither. George. Look at it up. We got this old uh, safety pin. Look at this old. That's a big baby. <laughs> He's not on a baby. That's a big baby right there. That is a. That's a big baby. That's a big baby. <laughs> I don't know what this thing is. It's a disc. Perfect for maintenance for records. I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, Rotating like maybe to clean, like to clean them. To, I think he cleans your records. So that's kind of cool. And then we got Christmas theme. We got Mary Joseph and the baby Jesus. Oh. 
They might glow in the dark. I don't know. Kind of look like that. Oh yeah, they do kind of look like that. So, I don't know. Got them. You gotta turn the turn the light off and see. You got this little thing. This thing's cool. It's like a little hook thing. You turn it like that to hook your stuff in. Put oh back. yeah, look at that. To keep it closed, yeah, huh? That's cool. It's old. Whatever that thing is. And I don't know what this thing is. Oh, I know what this thing is now. Probably should look this up. This is for a remote control car, Cox. The old remote control cars and with the motors in them. Uh huh. Co this is a tool for a Cox C O X um, remote control car from like the sixties and seventies. Oh. Oh, okay. That's the tool for. Like it. you fix, like change the tires. Well, or this whatever. is for like you know the top of the engine. Oh uh, yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah, you know, I mean that's probably worth something. I didn't. Yeah, you probably should have looked that up. Yeah. Man. Cox yeah. car, yeah. Dennis knows Cox car. He said yeah. Two. Uh, button hold button boot hooks. They're old. I have no idea what this is. Glow plug. I don't know what that is. I don't know. A little uh, knife knife set. Knives. There's all types of cool stuff in there. Uh, and we got a couple dog. There's a dog tag. Look at this. Brass, 1965. Wow. Boom. Brass, 1965 dog tag. The guy's name on it? York, PA. Oh. York County, PA. And then we got a couple other dog tags. 19, <laughs> 2007. 22 to Christina. Looking for 24. 2014. There's some other dog tags. And then, our last thing. And then, there's more. But wait, there's more. This thing, I don't know. These are all the parts with it. It's a microphone. What? Look at this. Some kind of microphone. It's like brand new. It's still unwrapped in. Boom. It's a microphone. Oh, wow. Bolex. B O L E X. Look that up. Made in Italy. I don't think it was ever used. I just took the plastic off. And you get all these little parts with it. I don't know what it does, I don't know what it goes to. But it's made in Italy, Bolex. I should have looked that up too. But I didn't. So that's the little house lot. House, everything else lot. But the microphone's cool. There's a little one off. I Definitely cool. 24 to my crutch. We're looking for 26 or more. If you want to see anything else up close, let me know. I'm going to throw it back in the box. Sorry, baby Jesus, I just threw you. Oh, that Cox wrench is kind of cool. That is cool. Dennis knew what it was right away. Yeah, I'm sitting there going, oh. I, as soon as I sold Cox, I went, oh, because I just sold, well, you know what, I sold the planes. The remote control planes. Oh, yeah, yeah, this yeah. Is, went, that the same con is that the same the, as the The motor was, was oh, Cox. Oh, 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 okay. So that yeah, like, yeah, probably yeah. went to the plane. I just, I just sold two giant gotcha, planes. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Okay. That's as soon as I saw it, I knew what it was because of that. Right, okay. I can't take the mustard out if you don't want the mustard in here. Wild school. Look at that. Yeah, I know, I know. That was uh, a 26 to Christina looking for 28 or more. House lot. House lot. And I got to think about what I'm going to do. Oops. Um, time is it? 926. This is Ashtray took a lot of time. <laughs> yeah, dude. It's like four lots. Yeah, jeez. I gotta get out of this onesie. <laughs> Jingle Meow said, I waited all night for that wallet. I'll go one more time. 28. <laughs> 28 to Jingle Meow, looking for 30. Sounds like you can get you can knock Jingle Meow out with one more bet. Yeah. Bid, I mean. Throw 50 cents on the end of that next bid, too. Because you know, she pretty much told you she's done after <laughs> that. You can't tell people, Jingle Meow. Now Christina says, okay, 30. Yeah, right. No big deal to me, she said. No, she didn't say that. Oh, I still got all that advertising to do. I'm going to do that now. Oh, my God. You're going to take forever. Dude, I'm going to take forever with these Jeez. papers. They're cool papers, though. I'm going to have a ton of them. I can add to that. 
32 to Mike Kretzer, 35 to Christina. Jingle Meow says she's too honest. Yes. Yeah, and didn't Christina say, do you have any cameras? I had one in a box. Yeah, you had one laying there. Yep. Hey, Jingle Meow, that's not a bad thing to be too honest. No, that's not bad That's at not all. a bad thing. Not a bad thing at all. Everyone. Just, just bad in an auction. <laughs> right. In, a, in an auction setting, it's not great. It's not good in it's an auction great. setting. Any other time, we're good. You know what? You can always come back. You know, this is not blood in, blood out. We're not a gang. No. This is you can come right back. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you can say you're out. Many people do it. I don't know. The microphone probably shut up. The Bolex. I don't know. I don't know. That might be really good, but the little devil guy's cool. I don't know what that is. Lemon yeah. juice thing? It might be lemon juice. And like a special brand or something? I don't know. Or like Never a like a holiday, like a, a Halloween edition or something? I, don't know. I threw this lot together besides the camera today. 35 to Christina going once. <laughs> Ed says, just give me all the asteroids. You got them all, Ed. That's it. I got. I had to go to the garage and get some. Yeah, you you kind of wiped them out. You wiped them out two, between two, the two other lot you bought. Two different auctions. Yeah. Final call. Final call. My Kretzer's out. I don't know who else we had. We had Jingle Meow. She's out. Mike Kretzer's out. Okay, he said he's out. All right. Sometimes the chat lags. Okay, Christina is at 35. Final call. Looking for 37 or more. Oh, we're going to sell it to Christina for 35. Uh, let me just make, give it a minute here because I know there's lag. I don't want to cut anybody off, but I think the people that were bidding were, are out, actually. Mike and Jingle Meow said they were yeah, out. Yeah, they both said they were out. <clears throat> so I'm gonna sell it, Christina. Oh, oh, oh. So, 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 so. Let's make sure it hits over there first, John. Yep. Yep. Okay. So, so, so. Thank yeah. you very much, Christina. Appreciate you. Thank you, Jingle Me Out, and Mike Kretzer as well. Christina, I'll put your name on the spinning What's wheel. A lot you gonna do. That over there on the left the there. Joke? Yeah. Uh, Christina for 35. Did we write that down? Yes, we did. Thank you, Christina. Thank you. Appreciate you. All right, I have an a advertising lot like we had last. Was it last Sunday we did? No, you did it on Thursday. Thursday night. Oh, that's right. I did it on my Thursday night. Yeah. So these are um, pulled from different magazines from all different years. Most of them are, are, pretty, uh, are pretty old. Uh, I'm going to start the bidding at 14. A lot of cool. There's Coke. There's Pepsi. You'll see. There's all types of stuff. And I didn't write it down, Johnny. So if you want to write it. Okay, I got it. All right, guys. So right now, uh, this is the lot as it sits. There is a number, a huge stack of these advertising things. They're all they're all different. They're not all one genre. Um, but uh, like this is a cool Coke one. And this is from 1949, I think. Oh, there's a whiskey one on the back here. There was a date somewhere I saw, 1949, copyright 1949 on the bottom there. So there's one Coke. Here's a Pepsi. You know, this is how everybody was back in the day, wearing their suits and ties and fancy skirts and whatnot. This is from April 1954. Here's another Coke one. This one's got a little creasing. They have, they'll have a little, a little bit of wear. They were taken out of actual magazines or, or other advertising. Uh, pieces. This is 1955. You can you can see they, they took it right out of there, but it's pretty cool. Here's old granddad. Old granddad. This is uh, old granddad on the back. Check the backs of these out. I won't I won't show everyone, but some of the back. That's where I found that military guy on the cell phone. I don't know if you guys saw that. It was an old. This is from Ladies Home Journal. This is Seven Up, and this is from. 8 August 1948. Look, back to school. That's how kids went to school back in the day. So that is 1948. Oh, look at this old one. It's not. It's in rough shape, though. There's a hole in the middle. Like, can you see my hand back here? Right on this kid's, right in the middle of his head. And they're staining at the top and creasing and little tears. But this bad boy is really cool. It's Coca-Cola. 
advertisement. Camels on the back. Uh, 1932, 1932. Johnny, check out this Coca-Cola one when you get a minute. We got this old Jeep. Now we're in the Jeep. Toledo, Ohio. Country Gentleman. This is pretty cool. It's Jeep engine power. Uh, this is from Country Gentleman, June 1948. We got this Ford Tracker. Gives me the power I need. This is from July 1948 from the Country Gentleman. I mean, these would look cool in frames. Coming back here. Western Electric, a unit of the Bell system. And then, I don't know, we got different soaps, that things I've never heard of that are probably coming and gone. Chipso, Quick Suds, March 1925 on there. Check out that Coca-Cola advertising there. Oh, that's an old one. Yeah, it is. 1925, I think. Wow, that's cool. It's got some wear to it. Got some oh, holes in it. Del Monte. Love their peaches in the, in the juice like that or whatever. We got RCA Victor Television. It looks like we got Bruce Myers at 20 right now. And this is from... Yeah, do you want to use the gloves? Oh, that's right. 49. I mean, right. really? You're right. Oh, my God. Hold on. Let me get a new pair. You got to get a new why well, didn't start? Bruce Mike goes, you might as well just auction the gloves off. Right, okay, right. He's putting them on. I'm putting them on. I forgot. <laughs> um, we're not used to it. We should just keep them on. <laughs> See, that's why I'm afraid you can't keep them on. You have to like use a new pair of them. He's getting them on. I'm getting them on. Okay. All right. Oh god, this one only has four fingers though. He has fourteen <laughs> pairs. <laughs> All right. This is the zenith. Ad from the Saturday Evening Post, it looks like. And this is from 1955. New Edison, Saturday Evening Post as well. There's a Victor. This one looks old. Sorry, I wasn't in here. I was in another room to tell him about the gloves. Sorry. If you don't want to bid because I wasn't wearing them, no problem. I'm, I'm just trying to go back and see where we're at. I think... I think Bruce is at 20. Ask him if they don't want to do because I was wearing them. Oh, they're fine. I'm just saying, if they want to. Um, I don't know, Westinghouse, radio, phonograph. There you go. I don't know what this is. Ham oh, there's some watches ones in here. These are cool. Hamilton watches. There's a couple of these. Like, yeah, you, remember how he looked on his birthday and he gave him a fancy watch? No, you didn't. Or, you you got a Grinch wearing gloves. <laughs> right. I need green ones. Match my outfit. It says now you look professional. Oh, I do. I do. I look something. Here's a Hamilton. I wasn't going to say professional, that's right, for sure. Right. Here's another seven up. Nothing does it like seven up. Saturday evening post from March 10th, 1956. Very cool. This is another seven up one. A lot of seven up in this one. July or sorry, June 1953 from the ladies' home journal. Look at that kid. This is got a sailor cap on. Yeah. He's ready to go. Another seven up from 1958. Copyright 1958. Yeah, let's look like a 50s buzz cut there, right? Well, here you go. Lucky. Nothing Lucky says like strike. we're sitting on, on the beach, getting a tan, smoking cigarettes. This is like everything you can't do in 2020. Can't go to the beach. Can't be this close to somebody. Can't smoke, right? Oh. Especially unfiltered cigarettes. You can't do that. <laughs> this is like things that like you tell your kids like they, look they like, don't believe you. They look like they got the scale out. <laughs> right. Right. <laughs> right. Uh, this is 1917. The Saturday Evening Post, 1917. Can you see that page there? And this is pronounced Clico. Clico Club. Clico Club Ginger, ginger Ale. Ale. Clico Club Ginger Ale. Royal Crown Cola. RC Cola, baby. See, it's taken from a magazine, so there's a little wear on the side there. RC Crown, RC Cola. This is from 1938 Life Magazine. Here you go. Some more things you can't do. Be this close to people. Smoke cigarettes. I didn't know there was a Philip Morris cigarette. Philip Morris. I thought Philip Morris was the, the was company the that company, made it. Right? Yeah, you're right. There's a Coke, Coke ad on the back. Sing the Coke song. I'd like to, to teach, teach the world to sing, sing. perfect, perfect harmony. harmony. Have some more. Here it is. 
There's everyone singing and gathering around. They're singing that song. And a shave master, sun, sunbeam shave master. Sunbeam makes bread, don't they? If they make, look, it looks yeah. like a piece of bread. Yeah. You got RC and a moon pie. 1847 Rogers Brothers Silver Plate. Ladies Home Journal, March 1925. I don't know what's that. Oh, here's some car ones. Plymouth. Plymouth. So right now we're at Bruce Myers at 20, looking for 22. I already yeah. said go on once. Okay. Well, don't call it yet because I'm not sure. No, 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 no. I just said go on once to get it because no one else is bidding. Uh, Pompey and Night Cream. That's okay. We can sell it to Bruce. I'm not saying. We just no, no, no. I it. only did go on once. I didn't do final call yet. Let me get through these first. Hang on. Another beauty powder cream thing. Beauty powder thing. Oh, fuller brushes. Spick and span. Spick 1922. And span. Another night cream one. What's on the back of this? Oh, some dresses. There's one there. There's one there. Uh, mum's the word. Mum. Prevents body odors, a delicate deodorant. Oh, look at that. Hawaiian pineapple. Nothing better than a fresh pineapple from Hawaii. Yeah, I love pineapple. Except when it gets like down to the, like, closer to the bottom yeah. there. But it's nothing better than when you're in Hawaii and they cut a pineapple and cut it up oh, for I've you. Never been fresh to off the stack. That would be awesome. It was awesome. Stewart. I don't know what this is. A horn? A car horn? Stewart motor horn. Yeah, $5. May 31st, 1924. And we got the DeSoto. Spent my 22nd birthday. I turned 22 over in Hawaii. Nice. Yeah, my buddy turned 21 when he was over there. I would love to go to Hawaii. It was awesome. I bet. We drank so much. I bet it would be. All right, so that's it. I don't know how many pieces. There's a lot of pieces. We're not counting them. We're not counting them because I got the gloves on and I can't move them that quick, that good. So there's the lot. And we can say final call to Bruce. Final call. I'm putting it in. Final call. Since it doesn't seem like there was much interest, I think it was on the first okay. yeah. It's the final call. All right, I don't think I have any more. Uh, I have. Oh yeah, I do have another lot. I can't use these gloves for my next lot. Not my next lot, but my next next uh, camera lot, right? Yes, my birthday is January 21st. Alrighty, Bruce. Thank you, buddy. Sold, sold, sold. Bruce Mize, $20. Thank you, Bruce. Yes. Good deal. This one, this one alone is probably 10 bucks right there. Don't that think? Coke one. That's yeah, cool. That Coke one yeah, that's that is good cool. Money, Bruce. Good deal. All right, we sold to Bruce Mize. I gotta get my lot together here. Oh, since we showed these in the preview. Yeah, there we go. Okay, hang on a second. Jesus. So I can't use it. The Bruce says I can't use it. You wash them. I'm not washing them. I'm not, I'm not washing gloves. Come on now. All right, thanks, Bruce. Appreciate you. Thank you very much. If you want to take them out of there, you can wash them. Bruce I'll wash them. Okay. I'm going to keep them for... Bruce Mines. Thank you, Bruce. Yeah, don't throw away. Okay, I'll give them to you. Give them to me. I'll wash them. Thank you, Bruce. Appreciate you. Put your name into the spinning wheel. And now Johnny has some Pokemon. All right. This is... Choice. This is the. I don't know what kind of pack of cards are. So you're getting three packs of cards. And we're starting at sixteen dollars. Your choice. You get a uh, hollow, three packs, and a pog or a coin or something. So these are the sword and shield battle styles. Sixteen dollars. Pick one or two. This one has a Jolton. Um. Hollow on it. The three packs. Sixteen, you said, right? Yep. Yep. Okay. And this one here has Eve. Evie. Evie. Yep. Evie. I know that one. Okay, you got Evie Hollow with three open pa unopened packs of Sword and Shield, Darkness and Blaze. This one's called. Oh, there's two different ones. Darkness of Blaze, and this one here is Battle Styles. I never noticed that they were two different. They're two different ones. They're new. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Now it's choice. You're bidding choice. on choice. You get this choice. This one's 2021. This one's 2020. The EV, EV one is 2020. The Jolton is 2021. Diamond West. I 
Silver beat you uh, right away. Silver, you were first in. Hang on a second. Hang on, John. Hang on a second. Okay. Silver, you bid 16. Diamond West, if you want to be in your eight, you need to be 18. Back by Silver, you're not bidding against yourself there. Cool. All right. West is at 20. West is at 20. And then, Ed, I don't have January House stickers, but you get a nice uh, handy thank you card. <laughs> <laughs> So All right, so Diamond West at 20. And remember, it's choice now. You choice. pick one or two, and that's fine. If you want two, then you just double whatever your winning bid is. If you want one, you can have one. But one, want, yeah. I didn't notice this one was Darkness Ablaze. Sword and Shield, Darkness Ablaze. And this is Sword and Shield Battle Styles. Oh, okay. I didn't oh, so notice. they're different. Um, they're, one's 2021, 2021. The Battle 20 Styles and 21, right. 2021. Okay. The other one is 2020. Right. I didn't know. I thought assumed that they were the same. I just looked yeah. at and didn't know. No, that's fine. Yeah, I wouldn't know. I wouldn't know if I didn't look that close either. Yeah, because I got them all yeah, together. Stick stare at them. They're probably on the same. Uh, they were on the same hook. Really? So I just grabbed them because I saw there was two. I probably should have bought more, but these were the ones that were different hollows on. Thanks, Bruce. Appreciate you. All right, twenty-two Diamond West. I'm going to say going once yeah. because Back by Silver was out going once, and he was the only other bidder. In the lot, you all right? You hurt yourself? Come on, out. You know you're not on. All right, back by silver says darkness ablaze is a good set. I, I be honest with you, I had no clue, guys. I mean, I just looked down and said it was. I saw it was different. Yeah, it just looked like I don't want to have two of the same. So here's a different one. I'll pick this one up. Well, that's right. I, I picked the, the cards, two hollows. Right, that's yeah, just with the cards, I just yeah. grabbed them. I didn't know they were a different um, series because I ne they're never at the store. Never. No, no, and no, I no. walked in and went, "Oh crap, there's some there." Right, right, right. And I'm starting what I paid, so I'm yeah, you know, yeah, yeah. I'm just trying right. to get my just money back get, out of them. Yeah. I mean, I'm not making much money on these guys. I'm mm -hmm. not not here to do it. Because no one else can find them. Right. I heard you. You're hard to get. I mean, back out silver says he goes to stores and can't find them. I just, if I can find them, I'm going to grab them and spread the wealth. All right. Final call Diamond West Robinson at 20, looking for 22 or more. Remember, this is choice. You can take one or two if you win. You're not big. It's not for both. Nope. It's choice. It's choice. I mean, I'll show them a little closer here. You get this Jolton with a. With a is that like a pod or a coin and three packs unopened? There's the back of this one. Oh, yeah, yeah. And here's this one, same thing. And then here's the back of this one. All right. So, sold, sold, sold to Diamond West Robinson. Do you want one or two? Do you want one or two? Diamond West, do you want one or both. two? He took both. Both. Okay, cool. So thank you, Diamond West. Congratulations. I'll put your name into the spinning wheel twice. Bruce said he just saw his at the store. They're hard to get, Bruce. You can't find them. I bet you go back yes. and they're all gone. Thank you, Diamond West. Appreciate you. Appreciate you. Appreciate you. Um, I will do my Zeppelin. I have this Zeppelin wind-up toy. Um, I'm going to start the bid. What am I going to start the bid at? Um, 12 bucks. I got this Zeppelin toy, John. Oh. I'm going to try to get rid of that. Come on. Out. Out. So, check this out, guys. I got this out of an estate sale. Zeppelin Collector Series Sky Rangers wind-up toy. He's cheating on me, guys. He went to a different estate sale. It was an online auction. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> and I was like, oh, I'll get these. Uh, it was, yeah, they don't. The other, the only one that has live in person ones that I go to is John. There's another company, but they're terrible. But there's a couple good ones that have online auctions. Um, so I check them out from time to time. And I saw this. Now, it's, just a, it's a reproduction from a toy made in the 20s. But I still think this is like from the 90s, maybe, late 80s. I mean, it has some. It has some. Um, Age to it. I don't just don't. I don't know how 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 old it is really, but it's in pretty good shape. Sky Rangers. And a bear flag is in at eighteen right now. 
I found more cars and trucks, Bear Flag. I'm going to send you some pictures. It's been really good. If you're interested, I know, I know, I found a bunch of uh, like Matchbox cars and stuff like that. I don't know if you're interested in that what? stuff, but a couple bigger cars. What? So if you're interested, I'll send you pictures of what I found. I still haven't found the planes. Um, there's a little staining on the back here on the on the box, but otherwise. It's a reproduction, guys. Uh, yeah. An old twenties toy. Right, but it, it is. But old. I think it's got old. It's older, but it's a reproduction. Right. But it's got some. It's it's got some age to it. It's right, but I just want to make sure. I just want to make sure everyone knows it's a reproduction. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it says it on the box. Yeah, it says right here on the box. There's just no year on the box. You can read it there. Yeah, it's not from the twenties. No, no, I just sure. make sure everyone knows. Yeah. Can you show it on the table moving? Is it? Sure. Well, might be too flat. Oh, uh, I, mean, I, I mean, this, I think it's probably this. Uh, it's might be that table. Working on it. I've used your uh, 1945 newspaper, but I'm sure you guys didn't like that. There it goes. It's a little hard. This table, I don't think it's going to do it. See, look, it moves. I don't think it's this table. I don't works. think it's the table. It's the table. It's the table because I got I use this to cut. It's got all kinds. Of it's got scratches on. All it, right, so. she's passing. We're at Bear Flag at eighteen, looking for twenty. We have uh, jingles out. Um, going once. Zeppelin collector series, Sky Rangers. There you go. This table's not the best table. Chilling, Skyling Associates, Skyling, Chilling, and I don't say S C H Y L L I N G Associates. Wind up toy. It does work, and it goes, but you need a better. I don't have. If I could get it over on that desk, but then you wouldn't be able to see me doing it. It would, it would be good. Right, so, Jingle was out. I'm going to hit final call. All right. All right, all right. No oh, Mike Crutcher's in a 20. Oh, okay. Well, now we got an option. Now we got an option here looking for 22. That's fine. You, you, you almost missed it. Because uh, Bear Flag's out now, so we're going to sell it. All right. Thank you, Mike Kretzer. We're going to sell it. You, buddy. Sold, sold, sold the Mike Kretzer for $20. $20. Thank you, bud. $20 to Mike Kretzer. Okay. And we got 951. Jeez. Um, Let's choose wise. Yeah, choose wise. <laughs> All right, Mike Kretzer. Thank you, Mike Kretzer. Appreciate you. Put your name in the spinning wheel. <laughs> Vintage kitchen utensils, yes. Yeah, kitchen stuff. Vintage. Cool kitchen stuff. Okay, we're gonna start out this knife sharpener, green handle knife right? sharpener. Twelve. Twelve, yeah. Is that what that is? A knife sharpener? Yeah. It says draw a knife lightly between this. Easy does it. Knife sharpener, green handle. Cool. Yeah. You got two, like, I used to use these when I worked in a kitchen to do, uh, um, yeah, like uh, melon balls. Melon or something. balls. Yep. Mm -hmm. We used to do melon balls with, you know, yeah, for like parties so two or of whatever. Them. Yeah. Because I used to make Sunday brunch at the Akamak Inn, which is a hoity toity. Oh, record. fancy, fancy, John. Yeah. Then we have an oyster shucker. Shucker. Yep. That's an old one with handle. Mm -hmm. 
we got this um, caterpillar. Oh yeah, old one, sharp, sharpie, Very sharpie, sharpie, sharpie. Yeah, stabby factor, and a little grinder on their side. Yep, yep, yep. yep. We got a um, press stoic cookie cutter, cookie cutter, red hand oh, okay. cookie cutter. Oh yeah, probably got some, probably needs some clean. Yeah, uh -huh. we got a jar opener. Oh, this. Easy twist. Oh, easy twist. Yeah, you line it up. Remove all, all screw caps. You can make it oh. small, big. That's going to be Tommy Wampus and fall off. <laughs> uh oh. There you go. That's for the really big jars. Yeah. I don't know how I did it. Something like that. that. And we got a jar opener. Or oh, yeah. This is another jar opener. Yeah, yeah. Small yeah. jar, big jar. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And. This is like a big waffle potatoes. Oh yeah, like and cheese. Yeah, yeah, cut yeah, cheese, cheese cutter, like waffle that. potatoes, whatever. Right. And this is a pie crimper, or for linoleum. <laughs> yeah, yeah, right. It's sharper. Right, yeah. It's sharp, too sharp. But I think it's pie crimper. That's funny. And then we have a can opener, bottle opener, all that jazz in oh, the yeah. one. Multi tool. Yeah. It's, a and J. A and J. Is that green? Yeah. Wow. Pouring out there. And then I think this is a juicer. Williamson juicer. Yeah, you squeeze it and then it comes yeah. out of the holes. Yeah, 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 you're right. Made in USA. Oh, yeah. There it is. Squeeze factor is pretty good. Squeezy. So we got three, six, nine, twelve items. All right, we got Jingle Me Allen at 14, looking for 16. Vintage Memories is out. Wow, that's really rainy. Yeah, it's bad. Holy cow. I say going once just to see what we got here because we're getting close to the end. Hey, I didn't get my paper knot. I found my keys. That's the way it goes. Have a friend. Yeah. You can do one more. You sure? Yeah, sure. I don't know where, mm -hmm. what, you want me, what should I do, paper or the camera? Uh, I don't know. What do you What do you want to do? I should do this with that one. It's cool. You sure? Mm -hmm. I'm gonna do one. Okay. Yep. Yeah. We'll do new one, we one then. Yeah, mine's gonna be quick. I'm just gonna do a buy now okay. on these postcodes. All right. Going once of jingle me out. Final call. Fourteen dollars. Any other interest? We're getting close to the end. Tonight, squeeze the lemon till the juice runs down my leg. What? What? Mike Kretzer. What are you talking about? You're getting a little crazy there. Getting crazy. Crazy talk. Yeah, we got lots ready. We always have lots ready. Johnny always has a, a yeah. I have a whole. I have a whole tub. And I have DVDs. I I just go pick ten DVDs and have a lot in two, like seconds. two seconds. Right. <laughs> we always have DVDs. If you saw the yard sale thing, you would know. Right. Or postcards underneath yeah. that table. But I have a whole st stack of song lyrics. Man, he said song lyrics. They are. He didn't make that up. All right. If there's no other interest, I'm gonna sell it to Jingle Meow. $14. Okay. Sold, sold, sold. Thank you, Jingle Meow. We will put your name in the spinning wheel. Jingle Meow. Jingle Meow. Okay, if I can spell it, I can put it in you there. You want Yeah, just if you grab that stack of 100. I got 100 vintage um, I'll show you. Here. International, whatever. Overseas. A oh, 100. Vintage. I'm going to call them international. There's some cool Egypt ones in there. International postcards. You're doing a buy now? I'm doing a buy now. $50. First one in the chat. No bidding. $50. I almost put $500. That'd be nice. Yeah. If, you want to bid, if you want to pay $500. Oops, I guess I should put the camera on. Yeah, that would I'm still in my onesie. It's so hot in here. 100 vintage international. Someone said I'll have it. A AJ contracting. If you want it, say sold. AJ contracting. You got to put. The I number. think you you got to put 50 in. Whoever puts 50 in the in the thing first. And if you're if you're not registered, make sure you register, please. We got all types of cool stuff in here. Is I, I mean, I'm assuming AJ contracting. He said sold. He did. Yes. Okay. Thank you. If, if you if you didn't sign up, please sign up so we know where to send it. Yes, yes, yes. 
Yes, yes. I'll look here in a minute. Oh, that's a cool job. Okay, AJ Contracting, we're sold. Okay. Thank you, thank you, thank you. See, I knew mine would be. Mine would be quick. 50 bucks. Okay. Thank you, AJ. All right, AJ, thank you very much. My hair's a mess. I know. My hair's a mess. I'm sorry. My hair's a mess. Thank you, AJ. Appreciate you. I will check to see if you're registered. You probably are. I just didn't know. AJ contracting. There's like 300 and some names. I used to be able to keep track. But it's a, a very large list now. I will look quickly while John gets his lot ready. Okay. Thank you, AJ. Appreciate it. I've got an ephemera lot. Johnny's got an ephemera lot. Three, four. Five. This is cars related. It's, it's, it's got a little bit of... It's, like mechanics related. Okay. I'm not sure how you want to call it. I'm going to call it lot number two because I lot think you did two, one, right? Yes. Okay. Um, there's three, four, five. There's seven or eight. There's four, 14. And we start out with stenographers, reference manual. Just a little lower in the frame. Okay. okay. Yep. There you go. Yep. What dates on here? 1954. Sonographer's Reference Manual. Oh, okay, cool. Southwestern Publishing Coming Third Edition. It's uh, I guess show you how to do stenography. Stenography. Huh? It's a hundred and well, fifty-one pages. Wow. So that's the first one. Then we have the War Department Technical Manual, The Machinist, nineteen forty-one. Yeah. November 12, 1941. So there's a machinist book. So I'm assuming this is World War II. I didn't know it was a war department. Then we have a 1960 edition, the new card buyer's guide. It's kind of cool. Shows all the old cars. Let's see what this is. Well, it's a letter. It's a letter. Lincoln Mercury Division. Dear John. The hell are you selling my book for? <laughs> why, oh why? So, 1960 edition, new car buyer's guide. Kind of cool. Shows all kinds of the cars in 1960. Then we have small gas engine student handbook. Your name's Todd. You're halfway there? You're halfway there. Shows uh, the student handbook. I don't know. Small engines. Pennsylvania State University College of Ecology. University Park. This is a Penn State one. Pennsylvania State oh, University. Oh, yeah. Cool. Then we got a welding engineer from 1960. If your name's Phil, you're good to go. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. This is uh, all about welding. Should have looked it up. Mm hmm. And I think this is cool. Here we go. United States Power Squadron Boating Course. Piling, Steamship, and Small Boat Handling. Uh -huh. It's got charts in here and everything. Mm -hmm. For instructional personality, not to be used for navigation. <laughs> Don't take this out. Right. Here's this. Don't try to. Uh... But it's your boating course. Um, I don't know what year it's from. Oh, 1971. There you go. So we got a boating court, and then we got this guy here. I don't know what this is. Hemmings Motor News, April 1987. I guess you can buy stuff out of this thing. The manual, I guess. Ah, these things are for sale. So you can buy stuff out of it. I don't know if you can get it anymore from 1987. April 1987. Our oh, yeah. 34th year. There you go. Or 4,400 this year. Oh, oh. Okay. That's what we got. Different All right, rules. 14 to Mike Kretzer. Looking for 16 or more. Different lot. I'm going to just call this a thumb lot two. Yeah. Started at 14, right? And we started at 12. 14. I think I started at 14. Okay. 14. Okay, looking for 16 or more. Uh, I'm going to 
gonna say going once. Going okay. once. I didn't know we were getting this Yeah, I think we're in that time of year now here in Penny where it just rains like every other day. Right. All right. Going once the Mike Kratzer 14, looking for 16 or more. Cool. Mike works in an engine shop, right? Yeah, that's what he said. Yeah. He said, I work on small engines. Yeah. yeah, there we go. Look at that. 1969. Yeah, that's what, yeah, he said, yeah. I like yeah. that. He likes that. It's kind of cool. Yeah. He even has exercise books in there. Mike, you might, not, you might want to use this exercise book. Oh, you know, oh, Mike's oh. Right. We're going to test you. Right. We're See if you know how to you. do Make it. Make sure you know how you're doing, what you're doing. Okay. Been, Mike's probably been doing it for 25 right. years. He's like, screw it. Since he was like 14. <laughs> yeah. Working on I engines. I need that book. I could pick up a wrench. I started working on engines. <laughs> All right. Final call. Mike Kretzer, $14. If there's any other interest, we're going to sell, sell it. Sell it. Sold, 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 Mike sold. Mike Kretzer. 14 to Mike Kretzer. Thank you, Mike. Appreciate you, bud. Thank you, buddy. 14, Mike Kretzer. He got the Zeppelin toy, too. Very cool. Very cool. Very cool. All right. Thank you, everyone, for stopping by. That is it for tonight. What's the black bag of stuff behind you on the cupboard? It's not a... Uh, there's a shirt back there. Oh, that's, that's my Hooters Racing uh, single stitch shirt. It's Hooters Racing. Single stitch, vintage, beefy tee, size extra large. You in the uh, single stitch vintage shirts there, Jingle Meow? All right, listen, thanks everyone who stopped by. Hit the thumbs up button for me on the way out if you're leaving. If you bought something, stick around because we're going to do the wheel. Bottom in a black bag. I don't have anything behind me on the black bag. I have a shirt. That's it. It's just this. It's just this. It's just this. It's just this shirt. That's all it is. There's nothing. There's no bags back there. That's it. All right, stick around. We're going to do the spinning wheel right now. Okay. All right. Uh, how do I get rid of this thing here? Cool, Bruce. Get rid of that. Okay. Let's do the wheel. Did we put, who was the last winner? Mike Kretzer, right? Mike Kretzer, yeah. Mike Kretzer, thank you, buddy. We're going to add you to the spinning wheel. And we will share the screen. And we will pull up the wheel of names. Oh, you know what I wanted to do? Hang on a second. Okay. You spin me right round, baby, right round. All right, here we go. Wheel of names. Let's mix them up a little bit. Shuffle, shuffle, shuffle. One more time. All right, here we go. Oh, Bruce Mines, Diamond West might win. Diamond West might win it. Oh my gosh, it's gonna be right on the line. It's gonna be right on the line. <laughs> oh my god, Diamond West is gonna. Sh <laughs> Can I see how close that was? Can I get a screenshot of that? Let's see. Bruce Mines is the winner. Can I see how close that was? Oh my God! It looks like it's on Diamond West's number. Oh my God! Diamond West's little shit. Look at him. Look. At him. <laughs> totally rigged. Totally rigged. Oh my God! We might have to. Uh, oh well, we get another pin. We get another pin. Oh, that's right. Maybe, maybe Diamond West will win again. Maybe Diamond West will win the second time. Oh my God! I forgot to. Um, I didn't remove that one name. Hold on. Can I remove one? Where's 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 Diamond West? Where I mean, where's Bruce? My I mean, I'm gonna take one of Bruce's names out. There we go. Okay, I took one off. Ready? Let's do it again. 
to Bruce Mize. Bruce Mize won. won. <laughs> Time and Wes. Could he win again? Could he do it again? Oh, new guy's going to win. AJ Contracting. AJ Contract is winning. AJ Contracting. <laughs> Jiggle me out said that thing only goes to the to to the right with Bruce. <laughs> recap time with Diamond West wants a recap. All right, everybody, thanks for stopping by. We hate the wheel. Use the hat again, Jingle me out said. No, we're not using that hat. It's terrible. Look at I need a hat. Look at my hair. It's a mess. All right, everybody. Thanks for stopping Thank by. You, everybody. I really appreciate you uh, being no here. No sale next week. No sale next Sunday. No sale next Sunday. I will see you guys later in the week. Uh, maybe Wednesday night auction. What do you think of that? Wednesday. Maybe Wednesday night. Uh, but uh, thanks for stopping by. Hit the thumbs up button for me. 